And if anyone is interested that's watching, let's do it. We can switch over to the live right now. Okay, we are now live, guys. No intro tonight. In fact, I have to do a new intro. You know that uh, that rock band from the 80s that did the cover song of the Edmund Fitzgerald? YouTube keeps giving me marks for copyright infringement. So, uh, unfortunately, I don't get paid for <laughs> during my lives anymore. Can you believe that? What? Yeah, guys. It has to be, everybody, you have to go over to the to the uh the auction on on the uh, smallmouth crush live if you want to bid everybody's here we're waiting for you come on how many guys we got on uh not that many 43 only tonight what the okay. heck is going on well that's that just means more opportunities Six, for the box. 60. all right now we're up to 60. 80. Okay, people are getting their notifications. We're over Listen, 100. Guys, we want to welcome you to the 2024 Smallmouth Crush Auction. This is a day that you've been waiting for all year long, baby. Tonight, Travis, finally opening up the boxes and getting rid of all the largemouth gear now that he moved up the trophy smallmouth country. And we got the one and only Epic Eric from the Bass Lab. And he's got some epic and custom painted skirted Willy Wonka Willy Worms for sale. And we got to get the best we can to support both channels, <laughs> both Smallmouth Crush Live and Epic Eric and the Bass Lab. Oh, yeah. yeah. All right, guys. All you Instagram people, get on over. Oh, yeah. All right. Here we go. Here we go. All right. I see some familiar and some unusual people on the Instagram Live, but we welcome you. We don't judge here. Welcome, welcome. Um. All right. Let's do the live. Actually, for the Instagram people, I'm going to give you a quick sneak peek at what the behind the scenes so i flip my computers over okay so normally i'm sitting over here right looking at you guys so uh we have let's see what do we got here we're gonna start out with all of these lots here bags boxes all kinds of craziness here we're gonna have some rods tonight Lots and lots and lots of cool stuff. Okay, and here I am just in my little deal. Head on over to my YouTube channel. Let's go. I'm out. Okay, guys, welcome. Welcome. What's up? <laughs> What's up? We got the famous auctioneer JP, tall as a tree of the house. Here little JP, go. little man standing strong. <laughs> Note taken fool he is, and he's a bass snatcher as well. Yeah. Let's I buy some junk. Here. Brett Carr right in the house. Let's say hi to everybody on the stream, JP. What do we got? Mo Money's in. Nate M. Slumpy Grumpy wants that frosted tequila. That's the toxic gill for sure, small mouth advisory. You got it, man. That is the DRT ghost in the toxic gill. All right. Uh, let's see. Yeah, brown bait, man. While we're uh, let's do it. Inter while we're let's doing do introduction it. here, I want to make a couple uh, statements. I know we have some Canadian people watching this auction. If you win and you live in Canada because of the extreme amount of money it costs to ship, I'm willing to do it. But you got to throw $20 on top of the bid. I'm sorry. Is that fair? That's right. I think that makes sense. We got to add 20 bucks. Here are the rules of the auction. JP is going to be the auctioneer. JP or his son is going to be calling the shots as far as who won. We're going to give you time. But we do screw up from time to time. Like someone will say 25 bucks and then... We'll call it, and we might not see that someone said 27. Whatever name we call, whatever name JP calls is the final. We can't go back and forth and argue. It is what it is. Can't do it. Make the so Canadians exactly. meet you in Lake Ontario to get their stuff. That's a good idea. Um, <laughs> you see a little deal on the bottom. 
It says Travis auction item. I take PayPal, so at Travis Manson, or Venmo, at Travis Manson Smallmouth Crush. Please do the friends and family. That way I don't get dinged with PayPal charges. And then when you do pay, I need you, please, put your full name and shipping address somewhere in the notes and keep track of the lots. So if you win lot 8, 25, and 42, let me know this is for lot 8, 25, and 42. It's real simple. And if you really, really, really want to help me out, you can send an email to my personal email, which uh, I'm going to try to see if I can get that to scroll to. That's tspeedm at yahoo.com. Maybe, JP, you can write that in the notes for me. tspeedm at yahoo.com? Yeah, I'm just trying to get my mouse over here to this fucking screen. Son of a bitch. Here we go. What happened? Uh, I'm just trying to see if I have a banner of that i don't create banner if you want you can wait to the end to make your payments if you if you think you're going to bid on more than one item um here jp i'm going to put in the comments i'm going to write uh boom there, I wonder if this will work. <laughs> there it is. I would just leave that right up there. Okay. It doesn't say anything about sending an email, but I'm I'm hoping I got to put that in here too. If you can, please send me an email at tspeedm at yahoo.com with the number of lots one and name and shipping. You don't want to say hi to your grandfather? Why? I'll say hi to him. No? Give him a shout. See, Travis, say hi to him. Go ahead. All right. Without further ado, JP, let's get the bidding. All right. Let's go. All right, guys. Here's the deal. We're going to keep it clean. Keep it fun. Coming at you with lot number one, baby. Lot number one. Starting price is starting out at $60. It is team, a team no fish. Yes, shipping is included. Whatever the final price is, that's everything. Unless you're a goddamn Canadian, you got to add 20 bucks onto that. <laughs> All right, let me try that again because I had a pretty good intro to this. All okay. right, guys, we're going to keep it clean and keep it fun. Coming at you with lot number one. Lot number one is going to start at $60. There's a pack of six Cortland Master Braids, 150 yards, five pound. Can 50 I get started out at 60, 60, 60. Look I'm sorry, 60. it's 50 pound, JP. Oh, that's 50 pound. I'm sorry, guys. So this, and listen, spot. the starting bids are normally half or less than the cost of the products, right? So we have six spools of 150 pound, 50 pound black Cortland Master Braid, and we're starting that out at $60 for lot one. Six hey, is, is is it isn't that my braid no, for this, this year for 2024? This is a uh, 50 pound braid. <laughs> okay, right, we're looking for 60 on the 50. Can we see 60? 60, 60 on that Cortland braid. 60 for the 50. 50 pound, 50 pound, 50 pound. Looking for 60. Can we get 60? Somebody throw up 60 for the Cortland braid. Six pack, 50 pound. What color is it? Black. Black braid, baby. Black braid. Black Master Cortland Braid looking for 60 on that 50. 50 pound looking for 60. We got 60 for Grant. Ooh, 65 for Dan. Dan's got 65. Can I see 70? Can I see 70? We got 65. Bart 65. goes, isn't that EE's Brotomic Braid? That was funny. Yeah, it is. 
I Dan, know you got more for me. Dan, we so got I'm you on really 65. 65, 65. Can I see 69? Grand 84's got 69, 69, 69. <laughs> Can I see 70? 69, 70. 69, <laughs> 70 for the 50 pound braid. 69, 70. Jablowski's got 25. We got 69 on Grant. Grant, we got Going 69. Once. Can I see 70. Going, Going twice. once. Going twice. Hold on, so hold on, great. hold on. Give it. It takes a little time. Ooh, yeah, Danny, Danny came out with there you go, 75. We got to remember, it takes a little time, guys. All right, what do we want to do? Um, let's see if anyone wants to beat Danny's bid at 75. That's a All right, Danny's got it at 75. Guys. Danny's got it at 75. Grant wants to poke me in the eye. Sorry about that. 75, 75, 75. Can I get 76? Can we get 76? 76. No, we want like 80. Go up by fucking 5, 10, 20 bucks. <laughs> What kind of auctioneer are you? We're going to be here all night. Exactly. Okay. 75, 76 to Grant. Can I get oh, 80? 76, 80. 76, 80. Danny. 76, can I see 80? Give, give it a second. We're not doing this again. You mean the auction? <laughs> Auction's over, everybody. It's canceled right. officially. Thanks All for right, showing up, and congratulations. Selling at All the right. grant for 76. All right, grant's got her. And then I think you uh, I think you need to, like, specify the increments of the jump, right? So if you want $5 they, they increments, not mess up from again, Eric, I promise you. Okay, I'm just saying, you know, this is new. This is All good. Right. I got one more lot, and then we're going to see what Epic Eric's got up his sleeve. You're going to because I've been dying to see. This is a big lot here. I got to take the volume off your mother. All right, let's do it. We are got you, lot number bust? two, guys. These are a That's them DD22. 35 DD22s. Wow. Some of these are 15, 20, 25 years old. Okay. They're very, I mean, they're rarely used. All kinds of different colors. Um, I'm starting that out 35 DD 22s for 140. 140. 140 on 35 DD 22s. Can I get 140? 140 custom uh, colors DD 22. 30, 30 of them. 30 of them. Travis. 35. 35. Just checking. 35. 35 of them for 140. I know Eric might 140. Want 140. He'll never use them, but he's he's itching because he likes some crankbaits. No, I, no, I would I would send them to TK for paint because ah, he'd sell them. I gotcha. I'm just trying to figure out the uh, price per bait. Four, four dollars. That's an average of four price per crank. Four dollars per crank per crankbait. Yep. that might be the max. <laughs> Lot number two, thirty-five DD twenty twos. Come on, guys. 35 DD 22s for 140. Can we see 140? 140, 140, 140 for the 35 DD 22s. <laughs> Darius King says he's probably got that many. Four dollars. So Darius should be fifty percent savings. That's a lot of crankbaits and a pretty good price, I think. Anybody for 140. Wow, so we don't have any DD22 throwers. Hey, I'm not one either. That's why I'm selling these mofos. That's right. They still catch them. Live well, scope killed the crankbait market. Oh, no. Tell me they'd so. Anybody, 140, 140, 140. Do we want to drop it to 120? No, I'll go sell these on Bass Boat Central, bro. Come on. Okay, no problem. Shit. Moving on, let's go to lot number three. Lot number three is an allotment of various spoons. <laughs> what kind of spoons. spoons do you have, Travis? Silver spoons, of course. All right, lot number three. <laughs> oh, spoons. spoons. I don't know, guys. They're just like jigging spoons and like... There you go. You Salt water or fresh or like. They're all, some are new, some are used. Uh, it's cheap. 25 bucks for all these. Lot number three. How many are there? 
I didn't count. Like, what are those? Live Target? There's a couple of those. Yeah, that's a live Target. A couple Mr. Uh, whatever those are. There's some, uh, I mean, just some fucking jigging spoons, bro. Buy them and give them your kid. What about chicken spoons? <laughs> Make a great Christmas decoration, too. Yeah. They still eat a chicken spoon? MJ oh, says yeah. he'll go 25. Ah. What? What, what was the starting price? Okay. 25. 20, we got 25 on the spoons. MJ, MJ's, in for, MJ's in for 25. So we got, got 25, 25 in. 25. Can we see 30? Can we see 30 on the spoons? We got 25. MJ, I'm thinking one of those ZD 22s. I'm thinking Travis not, is looking for 30 on the spoons. MJ said he would go 25. We got 30. Trent C for 30, 30, 30. Can I see 35? 35, 35, sitting on 30. We got about 25 spoons for $30. Trenton sitting on 30. Can we get 35? Look at that bag reflected in the sun. Go oh, out there and jig you up the big one. 30, 30, 30. Can I see 35? Can I see 35? Can I see I think, 35? I think 30 from Trenton unless somebody wants to. Uh, okay. You call it, though, JP. I'm not in charge of this. That's sold for $30. Move on. All right. How about Eric? What you got there, bud? What do I got there? Um, that's right. What do you guys want to see? Frank Bates is swimming. I thought you'd have something ready to go. Listen, guys. I did, man. Eric, Lot Eric. one. All or nothing. Eric. DRT ghost. But they're not doing that one. Eric's doing his. Go ahead. What, Travis? What are we going to say? If you win, Eric has a whole Travis, different we're say? payment. If, don't send your winning bids from Eric's lots to my account. That's right. That's right. In, in plain <laughs> English, right what, what Travis is saying, if you buy something from Travis, send it to Travis. And if you buy something from Eric, send it to Eric. We don't there want any go. of this. Let's go. Way. We got a lot of stuff to do. Yeah, okay. this is the DRT Ghost in Toxic Bluegill from Toxic Bait. Cedar Chavez, custom from DRT. It is one of the larger ones. This is a giant bait, as you can see. It is the Ghost. The minimum bid on this one is going to be 225 225 dollars That's the starting bid. A starting bid of 225 on the Ghost. It's the Ghost that catches they the go most. For anywhere for on eBay, 275 to 350 can we see with a special run color? Nobody's gonna buy that. I don't know. I'm just I'm just I wanted to test the waters, man, to see if there are any <laughs> ghost throwers out there. Yeah, that's just as bad as the DD22 lot, a bunch of small mouth. It might, it, it might be, man. Now I'm keeping the Walt. I have the junior version, yes, but I'm keeping that one. I can't throw this is too big for my arm. Yeah. It's a practice. It's I'll post it on Instagram, it'll get sold out there, man. Uh, oh, it's a repaint, all right, if you guys want to. Some swim bait dork will jump all over that. You got that right, MJ. Can we get it? And, sure, and by the way, sure. I got I, I did not it's dye my beard. Bait. I've been taking vitamins and they actually help your grays go away the more vitamins you take. Oh, that's interesting. <laughs> All right, man. Nobody's buying the ghost. Okay, that's. I just wanted to test it. I was just okay. curious. Okay, day. Travis, let's do the next one on your list so, so my kid can go to bed. He wants to do that uh, Z-Man minnow package. Hold on a second. Sit right here. So your kid can go to bed? That's funny, man. Lot number four. Okay. So you're doing lot number three. You got to say it. Lot number four. Z-Man minnow not... Nine packs of Z-Man Middles. Yep. Started, oh, camera. Starting price at $18. $18. $18. $18. All right, we got Z-Man Minnows. Nine $18 for Z-Man Minnows. $18. Can I see $18? Can I see $18? $18, $18, are, $18, $18, can I see $18? Most of them are $18, $18, $18, $18, $18. We got Slow a couple of the, uh, the Can I get an 18? Can I see an 18? Can I get an 18? Nine packs of various Z-Man Minnows. Can we get 18? How big are they, Travis? Rainbow. The minnow, minnows. 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 Can can nine packs of them. Rainbow. Three in. Can I get? A, can I get an eighteen? Come on, man, that's a cheap price. Can I get a twenty? 
Can I get an 18, 18, 18? Can we Come get on, an 18? Come on, man, 18 dollars. Let's Can I sit in the one zero dollars? Can we get an 18? Come on. Get an 18 in. C. Let's 18. go. 18. Come on, guys. Put up an 18. Make the kid happy. 18. Yeah, let's for 18 on the Z-Man Minnow. Can we let's take go. away $2? No, we're not taking away $2. It's a good deal. Something's going on tonight, man. I think I think the auction is not going well Don't for some people. Don't pay attention people. to Pe Peter Blasky. <laughs> He's annoying them. <laughs> what is that? Nine times right. three. That's three right. bucks a pack, Ignore guys. Do love not you. pay attention to Pete Jablowski. <laughs> love you, buddy. <laughs> not a good start. I didn't think we should cancel. Joe's over. <clears throat> man, couldn't even get 18 bucks with a nine-year-old trying to do the auction. Nobody wants oh, to buy some D-Man Minnows? You think I'm out early. <laughs> what has happened tonight? What's going on, Travis? Ah, we got one. Neil Bone. What you got? Thank you. All right. 18. That's Neil Bone. Bone. You got him, buddy. $18. Exactly. Give it to him. Give it to him. What is BBC Tackle? I don't That's even know, man. <laughs> All right. Who won lot four? Neil? Neil. Neil Bone. Okay. I'm afraid to hold anything else up. I got nothing. <laughs> what? <laughs> we're gonna we're it always this starts is, out. Oh, this you is a sad state of I got this a is a sad state up. of affairs. <laughs> I got a good one coming up, guys. I'll try one more. If this doesn't get a good reaction, I'll fucking close and shop. No, I guess Moving there's a on. there's a football game on tonight. That's part of the problem. Yeah, but there's still 197 people watching. I got two oh nine here. All right, I got I got two. Okay, two two oh nine. I'm I'm a little bit behind because I froze Lot my number screen. Five. I'm I, I don't I didn't count them. I'm just calling them huge. Four huge packs of power team lures. Ooh. These are the the uh J jig Texas rig rig jig three there and a go. half. Now we're talking. There's this color. It's kind of a green pumpkin blue, a pile of them in there. You got the green pumpkin copper. There's tons of them in here, guys. We're starting this out at $100. We have a pile of just straight green pumpkin. And then I have the largest bag ever of black and blue Texas rig jigs, three and a half. Very hard to find. You get this whole big box of Texas rig jigs. I don't even know if this company's in business anymore. Um, but they're they're actually really, I just have so many of them. The Texas rig jig works, and you know that, Eric. Well, there's no doubt. It's a great bait. So that's, that's basically a great bait. it. So it's got your flapper. It's got some tentacles here. You Texas rig this. You flip it. It's a great oh, flipping bait. It, it's like Those that know, no. Those that know, oh, no. Yes. Yeah, it's a spider jig skirt on the front, kind of like a flapping crawl. What's wrong? What did you do? What did it say? The comment did he pick up a just for men? Me and I was busting his chops about it earlier, and some guy commented sure. on his beard. Look at this. I, got, I, got I think they get like five, six, seven baits for like eight bucks. This is a hell of a bag of baits for a hundred dollars. Boy, guys, uh, guys aren't seeming that motivated. Approximately <laughs> how many baits? Carl, I I mean, I I mean, I, I don't know. I can't, I just, you know, there's 20 of them right there in a handful. This bag alone's worth over a hundred dollars. Easily. Retail. Huh. <laughs> huh. 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 
Well, what do you know? Huh. Well, it's oh, there we go. We crazy. got Jack Rinkers with a hundred. We got <clears throat> Jack Rinkers. Jack Rinkers with a hundred. Yeah. Yeah. At least that's shipping back to PA Bay. Jack knows what's up. <laughs> we got Rinkers with a hundred. Can we see 105? 105, 105, 105. We got a hundred going to Jack Rinkers. There you go. Walt goes. There's six dollars and eighty cents for eight of them. For six, he's done. Jack's got him. Take the hundred, Jack. Hundred dollars. There it is. Okay. <laughs> well, uh, I might as well I just keep one. rolling with one more lot, Eric, just to make it a funny. I got one. Hold on. It's well, a bull shad <laughs> custom painted gill. For all you bullshad throwers out there. Okay. Custom painted. Starting to bid. What's the starting bid, JP? Pick a number. Uh, how much do they go for? Not custom painted. Well, the custom paint's probably worth 20. Okay. Bait's worth, I don't know. Let's see what a bullshad gill's worth. Bullshad, bullshad, bullshad. Just gonna hold it up. Just let it marinate, JP. Luca. How are we doing? Start the bidding, JP. What do you Prime got? Prime fishing. Prime fishing says eighty dollars. Are you happy with an eighty dollars start, Eric? $80 going once, going twice. I'm just going to move it along. Okay, sold to Gators for $80. It's a great paint job. Gators Adventures, that's a steal. Uh -huh. All right, guys. Lot number six. If you went crazy over the last lot of the Power Team Lures, three and a half inch. And you missed out because Jack got those. Um, You're going to be happy. Don't worry. We have. What What do you got? Three huge packs of Power Team Lures, the larger Texas rig jigs. These are a little bit bigger profile. A huge ass bag of green pumpkin. Uh, a good bag of watermelon red. Another bag of green pumpkin and a big ass bag, big ass bag of black and blue. A little bit of red flake in there. Let me hold one of those up to you guys so you can see what we're talking about here. All great colors. That's the That's deal. $100 starting out. This is a, if you paid retail for all this, you went to Tackle Warehouse right now. In order to us, it'd be four, five, six hundred bucks guaranteed. Somewhere in the middle. We'll call it 500. Okay, guys, so what we have here is another Big box. Ass box. Look at them all in there. <clears throat> it's another box of Power Teams Louvers. These ones are for largemouth. $100. $100. Those ones look a lot better than the smallmouth ones. And we're looking for 100 bucks. Can we and get they're all? They're all firm. They're not crimped. They're all straight. I mean, most of them are. Maybe that one's got, you know, you might have to boil it. Uh, no these way. are the big version. I don't know. I don't even think they make these anymore because when I tried to price these out, I went on their website. Tackle Warehouse doesn't carry them. These are the big sizes. Four inch. Highly sought after baits back in the day. I hear you. They're not for everybody. Good flipping bait. Heck yeah. Darius says he's 64. You have to live to 100. What's that? That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. How many baits you reckon that is? A lot, Eric. There really is. Like, I'm not trying to, like, I think 100 bucks is a fair price for 20 pounds of these, you know? 
Right. Man. Well, let's put it. Let's put it in the pile that nobody wants, and we'll circle back at the end. Eric, what do you got? I got another uh, Buka little custom painted, beautiful shad. By the way, it's got a little olive back, a little light blue shoulder, as you can see. Scaling's perfect. Tail's perfect. That's a fine little bait. And I'll leave the custom hooks on there. You don't have to change those hooks. Those are the joint uh, right there. Man, that thing's nice looking. It's a beauty. It's a beauty. Start the bidding at what? 50? All right, let me measure it for you. I'm going to think. I want to hold it up for comparison against the bluegill. It's the same length as the bluegill minus a half inch. So this is probably about a four or five. This is about a five inch bait. I probably should get my tape measure. Oh, geez. I don't know if I'm going to sell this next lot. Is that another bull shed? Is that a bull shed, Eric? Oh. Yeah. Okay, mark guys. These gotta... in for, mark these in for 60. Oop, these man. are going to go up with $5 increments. I see M. Jones is up there for 50. Well, you guys are no, betting. No. I'm going to just write in the comments. Hey, what's hey. next? JP, it's Mark D has 60. Now Smallmouth Junkie has 65. Oh, they're not coming like, up so on mine. Yeah, yours is yours might be a little bit slower. So Smallmouth Junkie's got it for 65 so far. Let it marinate a little bit. Anybody for 70? We got 65. Can we see 70? Can we see 70? Look at the paint job on that thing. Looks like it's gonna swim right out of the computer. Sitting on 65, <laughs> sitting on 65. Can we get 70? 70, 70, 70, sitting on 65 with smallmouth junkie. Can we see 70 for that beautifully hand-painted bull shed? Look at that gill plate freckle. <whistles> that is a beautiful looking swim bait. I don't throw them things, but I want to bite that thing. Sitting on 65, can we get 70? <laughs> All right, go. we're going to move this thing along. Going once, going twice. Sold for 65. Sold. The smallmouth junkie. Thank you, smallmouth junkie. All Never right, lot number to seven. You love. Huge ass bag of power team lure hinge worms. So we got uh like a I guess I would call that a purple, blue, I guess blue fleck. If you're looking at power worm, there's that. There's a uh, Big ass bag of black and blue hinge worms. Like this is this is a lot of hinge worms. If you guys throw hinge worms or big worms and you've used these before, you know the power of them. We're gonna start to sell at a hundred bucks because there's a pile of them in here. And then I guess most of them are black and blue and blue fleck. So I got packs and packs of power team lure hinge worms. These you cannot find anywhere. I have no idea why they stopped making them. And uh, you're going to get that whole bag for 100 bucks if you're into those hinge worms. Look at that. Come on, JP. Get her going. We're looking for $100 on the huge lodge of hinge worms. They don't make them anymore, but they catch bass all day long. $100, $100, $100. Bag. Look at the bag of that worms right there. Can we see a hundred, hundred, hundred? That'd be a three to four hundred dollar value there. Does anybody fish for largemouth anymore? Come on, fellas. We need a hundred. Hundred on the hinge worms. Show the worm, Travis. Take one out of the pack right, and show it to show him. Show you the worm. Show the worm, bro. Okay, so a hinge worm. We're just gonna take this big old bag of black and blue. I'll pull it out. So basically, it's got hinges on it, and it floats, and it's got a little ball at the tail. So just a giant worm, good for, you know, throwing on those ledges down south or whatever. <coughs> Last time I threw these was on Wheeler Lake, and we did well. Okay, well... Put that one to the side, Travis. We'll set that one to the side. 
Oh, All right, you guys might appreciate lot eight. Go ahead, JP. Okay, lot number eight will keep you straight. It is a lot <laughs> of true bre- true bass swim baits, four and a half inches long. We're talking 20, pa- 20 packs of true bass, and he's looking once again for 100. 20 packs of swim baits for 100. Bass tricks. True bass swim baits. True bait. bass swim baits. 100. 100. 100, 100. Here. All good colors. You can't go wrong. These are the four and a halves. All in the packages. Ready to catch a big bass. The true bass Anybody swim baits when you're down on the Tennessee, Tennessee River, River. Right there. You're Forget throwing them down it. in them ledges. These are the swim baits you want. They're four and a half inches long and they go for a hundred dollars all day long 20 packs of swim baits for a hundred dollars can i see a hundred please for the love of god somebody put up a hundred 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 there we go m jones for a hundred we got a hundred can i see 105 we got a hundred can i see 105 20 packs of swim baits they are the true bass swim baits 4.5 inches long. yes these are the hollow belt the uh yeah, they're the. We're talking Kentucky the Lake. Heads. You're on the ledge. You put a three quarter inch jig head in it. You let it swim down there. You reel it back nice and slow, and you catch a five pounder. I know it's a good price, guys. I ain't screwing anybody over. I'm just trying to move some stuff, you know. That's funny. All right, M. Jones has got it for a hundred. Going once. Go ahead, Going Jones. twice. Sold to M. Jones, hundred. God dang, that's a good price, JP. I wish you would have waited a little bit. Oh well, you can't you can't complain about selling something. Well, it's thirty bucks to right? ship all the way to the fucking west coast, Eric. Oh, I guess you can complain about it then. I guess you, I'm with. Well, never mind. Sorry, I'm joking. Sorry. All right. I'm kind of struggling. I'm scared <laughs> to hold anything up, but I I'm just messing with you guys. Fear of rejection. Oh, what has happened? Remember how Throw true bass when you get your tire shot out. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Who said that? I don't know. Lot number oh, nine. Oh, my God. That's funny. Okay, guys. Lot number nine is a lot like lot number eight. We're going straight back to the true brass swim baits. This time, they are five and a half inches long, and there's seven packs of them. Seven packs of five and a half for 35. Can I see 35? If you like throwing big baits, this is the swim bait for you. It's seven inches long. There's uh seven Not packs. Not seven inches, they're five and a half. They're five and a half inches long. There's seven packs of them. Looking for seven 35. Packs, 35 bucks. 35, 35, 35. Oh, we got 35. Darius King. 35. Can I see 40? Oh, we got Will Perryman for 40, 40, 40. Can I see 45, 45, 45, 45 for the 5.5. Seven packs of 5.5s for 45. I'm on 40. Can I see 45? Can we get 45? Will sitting on 40. So ooh, prime fishing for 45, 45, 50, 45, 50. Can I see 50? Now we're having fun, guys. Come on. 45, 50. Let's see 50. Jablowski, shut up. Can I get 50, 50, 50? We got 45. 45, 50, 45, 50. Anybody with 50? <laughs> what was that? Oh, sorry. Sitting on 45. Can we see 50, 50, 50? Where did my comment go? Oh, well, we'll figure it out. We got the 5.5s, the seven pack. All right. on 45 going for 50 once twice sold for 45 to prime fishing all right prime you got her pretty good all right oh let's keep her going with some more true bass <clears throat> keep her going okay guys this is the true bass lot number 10 called the little minner i'm interested to see what these look like 12 Little minner packs of the little minner, 12 of them. Random good colors. What are we starting out with? 12 packs. <laughs> okay, these look like they'd be good for maybe putting on an eight rig, Travis. Yes, or okay. yeah, uh, starting bid $60. <clears throat> 12 packs for 60, 12 for 60. Can I see 60 for 12? 12 packs for 60. These swim baits would be great not only thrown on like a 3 8 ounce head single, or you can throw them on an A-rig, and we're looking for 60. 12 packs for 60. 
60, 60, 60. Can I see 60 for the 12? There we go. Will Perryman with 60. 60. Can I see 65? 65 sitting at 60. 60. Will, you had it first at 60. Can I see 65? 65, 65 sitting on 60. Nope, 65 to Zachary Gifford. 65, can I see 70? Can I see 70 sitting on 65? Those are some good looking swim mates. 65, 65, 65, can I see 70? 12 packs for 65 or 12 packs for 70? 65, 65, 65, looking for 70. Let's go up five. 65, 65, 70, 65, 70. Going once, going twice. Sold for 65 to Zachary Gifford. Very right. nice. Zachary got it for 65? Yep. Okay. Eric, I got one. I got one. I got one. Ooh, you guys are going to like the next one, too. Okay, we got an early model, Ed Chambers, <laughs> Zoom, Tat. Let's see what year it is. Yes, and These are hard to find. Right. 2005, mint condition. The paint is still wet. 2005, signed by Ed Chambers himself. If you guys throw Zoom crank page, you know all about it. If you throw Zoom Plastics, yes, it is the same guy, Ed Chambers, the late Ed Chambers, I should say, who made this. That's in the class pattern, arguably one of his best colors. And this thing is absolutely mint condition. 2005, early year model. You'll see these go, you know, 2014s for 65 to 75 bucks a piece. So that says Carl. Yeah. What do you, you got? Eric, what do you do? Eric Bo, Bo Judd said 50 bucks on the crankbait. Is that a good starting price? 50? Carl confirmed. Uh, Bo Judd, that's a little low. <laughs> I, I'm thinking 65 is going to be the minimum bid on this one. Okay. Eric wants 65, guys. Price. Carl for the hinge worms, Travis. dollars for that? <clears throat> Eric, Dude, these go for se these go for seventy five all day long. Later year models do. You can't find two thousand fives anyway. Okay, I'm just asking. Shit, I'm trying to sell a fucking thirty bags of crankbaits for sixty five bucks, and you're selling one of them. It's an 05. Oh, okay. Right. Yeah. <sighs> It's worth a hundred, but I can't. <clears throat> I saw sixty, Eric. Richard Baker's in for sixty. Okay, we're at sixty. Can we see sixty-five, fellas? Sixty-five, sixty-five, sixty-five for the pre-95. Sixty-five. Why is everyone laughing? Bo Judd with sixty-five. Sixty-five. Can I get seventy? Sixty-five. Can I get seventy? Bo Judd want to do with that thing? <laughs> He, <laughs> Bo Judd's in the lead. 65, 65, 65 to Bo Judd. Can we do 70? 70, 70. Let us get 70. Sitting on 65. Can we see 70? 70? 70? Joseph, this is this is the tap. It's a Zoom tap. So um, the original tap, Ed bought the you know, Ronnie tap baits are like, I don't know, 150. Uh, this is the same build as Ronnie tap because Ed bought the the rights to it and the machine that made it. So there you go, bro. Mm. 65 is the top bid. We'll give it to Bojo for 65. Bo Long time for 65. Bo Sold. Gets it, man. Perfect. Sold. All right. Keep her going, JP. Get the next slot intro. Okay, baby. Here we go. The Spicy Beaver. 24 packs. Of the Spicy Beaver in various colors. Yes. Uh, spicy beaver 24 pack starting out at 75 bucks. This is lot number 11, guys. And we have all good fish catching colors. There you go. <clears throat> the reaction the innovation of spicy game. beaver is not only a good flipping bait, but a good swim bait or, or swim jig trailer. It is the spicy beaver, and we're looking for 75. Can I see 75, 75, 75? Looking for 75 on the spicy beaver. Reactions yeah. innovation of spicy beaver. Here? 24 packs, guys. All good colors. 
I even got a handful of white ones for Swing Jig Fairly. Three of them, I believe. <clears throat> Can we see 75 and Spicy Beavers? 75, 75, 75, 75, 75. Starting bid. Looking for 75. Carl for 75, 75, 80, 75, 80. Sitting on 75. Carl with the clams for 75. Can we see 80? 80, 80. Come on, get it up there. $80. There you the go. Well, you know we got 80, 80. Let me see 85. Sitting on 80. What are those, Travis? 24 packs of spicy freaking beavers, bro. Will is, looking, Will is looking to pay $80 for spicy beaver. Can I see somebody else pay 85? 80, 85 for an scallop. Sorry, sorry, Carl. 85, 90. Looking for 90. Sitting on 85. Carl went all in for the rotten scallops, spicy beaver for 85. Can I see 90? 85 looking for 90. 85 looking for 90. Come on, come 85, on. 85 looking for 90. Sitting on 85. Carl with 85 going once. Carl with 85 going twice. Sold to the scallop man himself, Carl, for 85. Okay. What's next? Boom! <clears throat> oh, next. this is a fun one. Let's do a fun one. What do you got? Lot number 12. Last year's used motor cover for my Mercury 250. Blue cover. <laughs> DD26. The starting bid is $100 for the 250. For DD motor cover. Motor cover. It's uh <laughs> what do they what do they retail for, Travis? Like 250, 300. All right, cool. I'm just gonna if you want a motor cover, <clears throat> Mercury Pro XS 250. There it is. I mean, there is some you gotta pressure wash it. There's there's a little bit of hard water stains on the on the bottom of it, but it's in real good condition. I did the UV spray on it. Um oh, this nice. is a good well, deal, guys, for take, a cover. We know you take care of your stuff, bro. All right. I just want to see. Otherwise, I'll put on Bass Boat Central. I didn't know if anyone would be interested in this or not. Oh, dude, that'll that'll sell instantly on Bass Boat Central. Yeah, this is a real good steal, fellas. We got a Mercury four stroke two fifty motor cover, black and blue. Looking for a hundred. Let me see a hundred. He will autograph the back. Travis Manson himself, hundred dollars. Can we see a hundred? 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 It's a two hundred and fifty dollar motor cover going for a hundred. Tough crowd tonight, Travis. Jason, Very. I did dye my beard. I'm taking vitamins. It's amazing. <laughs> Matthew laugh. Weimer says if you toss in a beanie, he might give you a hundred. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let that marinate a little bit. We will. I'll hold up the. I'll hold up the next one to get people going in the box. Field package, storm wiggle wart. This is kind of for display, not for fishing. Um, it's really getting harder and harder to find a wiggle wart in the pack. This is a black shad, or I'm sorry, Tennessee shad. It is uh, a V51 wow. color. Tennessee shad, clear lip, three eighths ounce, three I'm inches. I'm surprised you would sell that, Eric. I have more. I wouldn't I sell my last one. Well, I'm just trying to hold up some good stuff. Somebody asked for some OG warts. There's okay. one in the pack. So if you're a real collector, this would make a great addition to your, you know, display yeah. case. Yeah. There you go. Fair enough. We're going to start the bidding at 50 because it's in the package. Dustin, nice try at 15, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just leave it hanging on the shelf for anything less than 50, and that's a good price. Brett so anyway, Carter says you can get 200 for that. Uh, Brett. Maybe back in the day. I don't know when there was mania going on around those. <clears throat> Piscator oh. Santos is in for 50. 50. Can we see 55? We got 50 for Piscator no, Joe, Santos. Both, Mr. Both Santos sides, is at 50. Can we see 55? We're at 50, 50, 50. Can we see 55? The original wig storm wiggle wart for 50. Sitting on 50, looking for 55. Can we see 55? Sitting on 50. It's a shit colored with red eyes. Original wiggle, wiggle work in the package. Shed. Stickers That's not right. even ripped. Never been opened. Mm -mm. No. 50. Sitting on 50, looking for 55. Man, this is a tough crowd. 
Ooh. does that have an orange? Is that an orange dot on the bottom of it? It shows it a little whisper, a little whisper of orange on the throat. Yeah, I like yes. that. Oh. Bring out the wood. Okay. Dosa, you want some balsa? You want some balsa? All right, we're gonna call it right there, man. It's a goodbye for that guy, Piscator Santos. You got it, man. All right, go ahead, JP. Okay, moving on. We have another pack. A pack of six, Cortland Braid, Master Braid, 150 yards. What pound test is that, Travis? 50. 50. Oh, another six-pack of 50-pound Braid for 60. It's the 50 going for 60. You 50 for 60, out on the first one. Here's a chance, guys. It's time to get your braid on your reels. Spring's 50. coming. It's black braid. It's 50 pounds, and he's looking for 60 bucks. Dan, for 60. Can I see 65? We got 60 looking for 65. Six Sitting on 60 looking for 65. 60, 60, 60 looking for 65. 60, 60, 65. God. 50 pound black braid, Cortland Master Braid. Best braid made on the planet. You got six packs, 150 yards each, and he's looking yep. for. We have it on 60. We're looking for 65. Dan's got 60. Let's see 65. Come on, fellas. Keep it interesting. Look, bring it up five dollars. 60, 60, 60. Looking for 65. Neil Bone says he's a 30-pound kind of guy. Sitting on 60, looking for 65. Didn't Danny win something before? Grant's pissed off because he paid $76 a little while ago. Now it's going to go for 60. <laughs> <laughs> 60 60 we'll give her 65 once we'll give her 65 twice pack. so there's six packs so that's ten dollars a pack right now i think it retails for what 24 25 bucks a pack yeah yeah sold for 60. we just had a discussion about how valuable this is and you just fine <laughs> 60 bucks I, All right, you know, 60 bucks. When I, when I have these my prices, brain. JP, the prices I have on your spreadsheet, that's the starting bid. And remember, that's shipping included. That fucking Paxton cost me 20 bucks to ship. Jeez, that's a good deal. I should have bought it, even though I was supposed to get it free. Can I, right. Is it too late to bid? All right, here's the next item. This is my lot five. This is, uh, for, you guys asked for some wood. This is some damn collectible wood. This can use. Custom bait, H and balsa. <laughs> what in the heck? <laughs> New in the package. These probably run better than Bagley. I know I said it, and you're gonna hate me, TK, for saying it if you're watching. But what can I say? That is a fine faded chartreuse black back, H and T vintage custom bait. Very thin Lexan lip. And for all you guys that like to throw my carta, if you're going to fish this bait, um, Lexan lasts a whole lot longer if you're grinding rock. And that's what I'd be throwing this on, rock and wood. Hard thumping, wide wobbling, fish catching fool, channel swing back in the spring, you're doing yourself a favor. One of my favorite colors. What do you like? Hey, somebody just donated 10 bucks. Feel bad for Travis right, not man. selling this bait. So here's a few bucks to buy a dollar of Chuck Norris beard dye. All right, Kyle Downey's in for 45 on the H and T balsa and Chartreuse Black Bag. These are really hard to find. Comes with the package and a nice note from Tim Hughes. <clears throat> so Jeff Thompson, hey, Jeff, for me. Running Travis's hey auction and fixing his power poles is a thankless job, JP. He will just accuse you of stealing rods. All right, Kyle. Kyle's got 45. I'm trying to get some attention on this <clears throat> item here, JP. Oh, come on, a lot it's 14. <laughs> it's a, this is the balsa bait. Jeff Thompson made the balsa. Tim Hughes, who was a very famous night, painter dude. back in the day. Holy yeah, it's going to be a long night, dude. I know. It's, it's not like oh, the old man. auction, man. Remember, I guess, man, the money's dried up. I don't know. Uh, we're, we're in for 45. Kyle Downey, 45. That's a great, that's a great I thought price. Spencer Shuffield was running the auction at first. All right. I'm going to I'm gonna call it. Uh, Kyle, you got it for 45 bucks, man. Oh, man. Thank you. 
enjoy it, man. It's a he nice does have a pretty black beard. Oh, black beard. Uh, <laughs> uh, Mark Levesque. Like, you kind oh, of look like BTC. All right, here, here's the deal. Hey, 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 what you going on here? JP, Yo. good God almighty. Mark, I've got two of these. Mark, if you want to pay me, I will sell you one for 50. Holy and uh, Kyle, will you go up to 50 for the ancient people also? I'm going to give that a minute. All right. Can I? Wait what? a minute. Just. Just let it happen for a second. Let it marinate. Can I go on a lot tonight? real quick? Yes, yes, lot, yes, 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 yes. Lot 14, Rod Warrior, eight-foot blades with the Russell right. Marine Light on the starboard side. $100, two of them. Basically, they're power pole covers. Really good condition. It's got the Russell Marine Light. Uh deal with it these are pristine condition this is for the eight foot power pole blades it's a hundred dollars for this we got eight foot power pole blade covers boys and guess what it comes with the russell marine light already carved out in it so it fits tight and it looks nice two eight foot power pole blade covers for a hundred bucks you can't beat that deal with a stick can I see a hundred on the eight foot power pole blade covers, boys? Let's go. Hundred, hundred, hundred. He's looking yeah. for a hundred. And I don't know if that if it that's like I just threw that in there to see if anybody wanted. I can put that online and, and get that. Man, people are not as um enthusiastic as they normally are at this annual auction. Now nah, we got some shit stuff right now, bud. Just wait till we get deeper in the lots. Okay. You'll see. Hey, speak, speak for yourself, bro. <laughs> I know, I know what BS Ghost was about to <laughs> say. Um, it looks like Todd, Todd, in your comment, I'll take the power pull covers. Todd, are you willing to spend the hundred dollars for those? Let me know. All right, what is lot? Oh, lot 15. You guys will like this one. Lot number 15 coming to you live from God Joe Bates. It is a God Joe. Guys, the, the power pull stuff. Let me know if if was it Todd that asked if he wants it for 100 He just didn't say, okay. Okay, guys, we got God Joe Bates Spirit 64 pack. Green pumpkin 64 pearl. 64 packs of green pumpkin purple. Green pumpkin purple, God Joe Spirit Chats. What size are they, Travis? Uh four inch. Four inch green pumpkin purple gajo spirit sheds for 150 bucks. That is a good deal, fellas. 64 packs for 150. 64 packs for 150. Will Clute with the gajo spirit shed. Green pumpkin purple flake. 64 packs for 150. 150. 150. I saw somebody asking about the spirit sheds a little while ago. Come on, guys. 150 for the spirit shed. 150 looking for 150. Green pumpkin purple. Yeah, I just don't want to break them up. So I had 150, or I had, you know, 64 packs. 64 or, packs. Uh, Matthew, I don't know either. Sixty-four packs of green pumpkin purple for one hundred and fifty. Come on, guys, let's see one hundred and fifty. Those are good baits. They work every single place you go to. Drop shot, Ned rig. You throw it out, best suck it in. Green pumpkin purple, sixty-four packs for one hundred and fifty. It is a lifetime supply. I will give you that. But for one hundred fifty bucks, shit. Come on, guys. <laughs> Let's see. I mean, really. That's two dollars and thirty cents a pack. It's pretty cheap. Philip Wade says he'll buy ten packs for thirty. This is like flea market pricing. I like it. I mean, this I mean, is cheap. I know it's a lot, guys, but god damn, I didn't want to add more lots. I could have done a lot of twenty, another lot of twenty, another lot of twenty. It doesn't make sense. Somebody's got one hundred fifty fucking dollars. Throw it out there, JP. Come right? on, don't get me fired up. 
Listen, guys, this is the Gajo Spirit Shed. It is the number one bait on Lake Ontario when you're dropping on them deep. It is green pumpkin purple flake, and it's 65 packs for $150. Listen, there's baits that are probably better, but for $150, bucks, it will get you on the water and catch you a six-pound bass. 65 packs for $150. 65 packs for $150. Come on, guys, make the show fun. 65 packs for $150. Pete Jablowski, <laughs> you are a jerk-off. 65 packs for $150. $150. $150. <laughs> <laughs> you want to chew some gum. <laughs> mm. All right. Well, we will. Didn't sell. We are going to put this on the. All side. right. Let's make it. Let's make it. Let's make it fun. All right. Two custom painted Rapala DT flats in very hot colors. Wow. This is the crazy color stuff, man. Fire tiger for all you river rats. And a nice hot orange red crawl chartreuse with an orange belly. DT flat. You're out of production. Hard to find. They both rattle. Custom paints. Those are some sweet looking crankbaits right there. I'm thinking I'm paint in Ticonderoga. Job alone, 15 each. Yeah, what do you I'm, what do you think? I'm thinking I'm in Ticonderoga. The ice just went out windblown rocky points and yep. i'm throwing that orange one right up on them rocks baby i'm grinding them rocks at five pound bass Muddy water that ass m right. johnson is 20 bucks that's right he's in for 30 because the paint's worth 30. m jones is in for 30. <laughs> right. can we see 50. 50 sitting on 30 with m jones looking for 50. i don't even know if he'll take the 30. sitting on 30 looking flat, for 50. black beard died Mark D's in for 35. Can we see 40? Black, black. Sitting on 35. Kyle for Downey's 40. in for 40. Kyle Downey's on for 40. Now we're looking for 50. Instead of going up five, let's go up 10. Sitting on 40, looking for 50. <laughs> if anybody's wondering, I'm extremely sick, and that's why my voice is like this. Sitting on 40, looking for 50. Can we see 50 sitting on 40? For all you guys in the comments, perhaps – Next week, we'll have a mini split these freaking lots up. And uh, that's the way to do it, Travis. And help the viewers out. Yeah. Kyle Jones, M. Jones, one of you guys for 45. And you got Mark Leves comes in for 45. Next there we 50. go. Mark, Mark's at 45. Can we get the 50? M. Jones, bring it to 50. Come on. Don't be out like Kyle. Bring it up to 50. <laughs> Sitting on 45, looking for 50. Half of 100 is 50. Sitting on 45, looking for 50. Come on, boys. Make it fun. Make it fun. Sitting on 45, looking for 50. The paint jobs cost 30. Eric's going to it's going to cost Eric 25 to ship them. Sitting on 45, looking for 50. <laughs> you need insurance on them things. They're so special. Those are pretty nice. <laughs> yeah, I know. They are, man. <clears throat> they are nice. All right. If nobody's in for 50, going once. Because because uh, Mark Levesque already bought something. So, Mark, I'll save on shipping by shipping to you, I believe. Yep. Mark Levesque got it. 45. Good job. All right, Thank you, Mark. Ahead. Oh, Kyle Downing for 50. Look at that. What the hell? I might have more. Hold on. I got to look. Thanks, All Mark. Right, well, for 45. As I Eric's got it. I got to look. look. Lot 16. Uh, fifteen dollars. It's just a bunch of miscellaneous Domiki head rigs. Uh, there's a bunch of them in there, all good sizes. All right, here there's we go, guys. I doubled up in the packs. All right, here okay. we go, guys. They are Domiki, they are Domiki heads. <clears throat> Smell. Domiki. Domiki heads so you can be like Randy Blockett and go out and shake your little weenie worm out in 60 feet of water. Domiki heads for 15. Looking for 15. 15 on the Domiki heads. Not a bad deal. Jig heads for 15. We got 15 for Scott Van. We got 15. Looking for 20. Looking for 20. Looking for 20. Come on, Carl. Bring it 20. You know you want them. Weenie worming out in 60. Looking for 17 to Carl. 17. Sitting on 17. M. Jones for 25. 25 looking for 30. 25 looking for 30. 25 to M. Jones. Come on, Ant, bring it up to 30. M. Jones is at 25. He beat you to it. Domiki head so you can weenie worm out in 60 feet of water. 25, 25, 25. Can I get 30? Can I get 30? Sitting on 25. Thank you, Anthony. 25, 25, 25, 25 right, and 30. Let's see between M. Jones and Ant where we're at. 
Okay, come on. Ant, do you want to go to 30? Because M. Jones beats you to 25. Well, we can jump to 26 or 27 with those. 30, Trenton oh, C. 30. 30, 30, 30. We doubled the starting price. Let's see if we can triple it. We're on 30. Can we get 35? 30 to 35. 30 to 35. Let's just give it to Trent. That's a good price. Okay. All right, Trenton for 30. Trent, you got right, it. Next one up is uh, my lot eight. It's the same thing, same two ones. And uh, I think Kyle and David, uh, Mark Levesque got that last one. Which one <clears> of you guys <throat> wants this lot of the DT flats, same custom color? <laughs> Jeez. And, and David and Kyle, if you guys want individually, I've got this will be lot set eight, and this will be lot nine. A fire tiger and a lavender shad. Fire tiger and a lavender shad in the DT3. So this is lot eight. Lot eight. Lot eight. DT flat custom. Lot 17. Lot oh, oh, hold on, Travis. Can no, I I'm, bro, we got two screens. We can go, bro. Let's do this. No, bro. It's confusing, man. Just give it a second. I'm just holding things up and letting people know these are doubled up Z-Man finesse worms coming up. Okay, good. I like that. M. Jones, you want the 40 on the lavender? Can you go 45, bro? Because I'm shipping it free. M. Jones, talk to me, bro. 45 on the lavender. <laughs> All right, M. Jones, you got it. All right, that's <laughs> lot eight for M. Jones. Lavender, 45, free shipping. <clears throat> M. Jones, 45. Oh, Prime Fishing says he'll take him for 50. Which ones? The one you were just holding. Prime, which one? He says the Fire Tiger and the Prime. I got you, man. Prime Fisher, you're going to get lot nine, which is the Fire Tiger DT3 and the Lavender DT3. Prime Fishing. These two, Prime, <laughs> I just want to be sure. Prime, is that the ones you want, the Fire Tiger and the Lavender? Fire Tiger and Lavender Prime. Just say Lavender with the Fire Tiger Prime, and you got it. All right. Lot number 17. Or did you want the red one with the Fire Tiger? Tell me which combination you want. Where you at, Prime? <laughs> the others, if you have more. Okay, so you're talking about this combination, right, Prime? Fire, Tiger, and Red Crawl? Prime? Prime says no. The others, if you have more. Well, I'm just going to wait for him to just tell me the colors because the red and the Fire Tiger. Gotcha, man. Prime Fishing, you're in for it. Gotcha. Prime Fishing's a good guy. Three. Okay, Prime moving on. Red yeah. and fire, yeah. Eric. Red yeah. and fire. We got it. Got red it. We got it. Red and fire for Prime Fishing. Next up, lot got number it. 17, Z-Man Finesse Worms. Eight packs, but some are doubled up. Great finesse bait. Shake it around on a drop shot. We got $17 starting out for Joseph. No, $20 on lot 17 for Joseph. Okay, lot number 17. We got twenty dollars from Ken, aka O2 Man ninety eight. He's got twenty, so we got twenty. Can I see twenty five? The Z Man finesse. Ken. The Z Man finesse baits. We're sitting on twenty. Can we get twenty five? Listen, I'll tell you guys with the Z Man. I don't know if you guys throw or not, but one worm will last you basically all day. Uh, so four inch, four inch guys. Sitting on twenty. Look at twenty five. June bug. <laughs> Joseph Gill for 25, 25, 25. Sitting on 25, can I see 30? The Z-Man Finesse Worms, 25, looking for 30, 25, looking for 30. 
went from 20 up to 25. 25, 25, 25, looking for 30 on the Z-Man Finesse. Z-Man Finesse. Do you accept EBTs? Looking, sitting on 25, looking for 30. Samadis wants to know if you'll take EBT card. 25, 25, 25, looking for 30. 25, 30. How do you know what that is? This is what is that? The Z-Man Finesse. It's a welfare card. <laughs> It's a oh, Z-Man Finesse eight pack. We're sitting on 25. We're looking to see All if right. we're 30. Let's move on. Give it to whoever has 25. Who had the 25? Joe Gill. All right. Lot 18. It just says packs of gambler lures starting out at $20 for lot 18. And here they are. Oh, shit. So first you're going to just get, I don't know what these are, the otters or whatever they're called. Okay. Actually, I should talk about this. This is a special color for Tidal Water, but it can work anywhere. It's black and blue with a little bit of – it's just it's a crazy color, guys. This was a special run color by Gambler. We're starting these off at 20 bucks. You're going to get this huge-ass pack. Then we got some uh, – what are those? The Big Easies, Copperfield. I got some whites. And then I don't know if these are Gamblers, but they're Big Easy as well. White. Then I got some, uh, that's a Houdini. And then I got some, whatever the, that color is. So all this for $20, guys. Not a bad deal. We got the Gambler Value Pack. Bunch now, I'll tell you what. Bunch of I, I, $20. These are like a really legit color in here. Yes, that is, the, that is called Black and Blue Sapphire. That is great on the title Hudson. Okay, we got Neely Bone for 20, but Carl beat him with 25. The Scallop Man coming in with $5 above the starting price. 25 looking for 30, 25, 30, 25, 30. Carl's out there scooping scallops like it's his job. 25, 25, 25, 25. Can we see 30? 30 on the gambler bitch. And we got 30 to Robert Linson. 30, 30, 30, 32, 50, 32, 50. Can I see 32, 50? Sitting on the with Carl coming back with a 35. Carl likes gambler. He throws it till he dies. 35 35 35 can i see 40 on the gambler the gambler value pack brought to you by travis manson it is black and blue sapphire flipping baits and then numerous swim baits sitting on 35 with carl the scallop acron 35 35 35 can i see 40 can i see 40 how long do you want me to sit on this one travis we got carl right. at 35 Give it to carl, to carl. carl for 35 <laughs> all right next uh, up lot 10 okay. a dt7 flat custom lavender <clears throat> shad and a dt3 make a nice combo this bidding starts at 50 because the dt7s are definitely harder to find man anthony guys what you looking for what kind of excaliburs you know i got excaliburs in the house <laughs> <Come on. laughs> <laughs> DT you sound this you got DT7 name. and DT3 plat lavender shad combo pack. <laughs> Grant wants the XRK 50s. The one knocks. You know I got a man. I don't even know what to start the bidding at. Grant, what do you say I start the bidding at on an X caliber XRK 50s? All right, raise in for 50. 50, 50, 50. The way, what do we got? A, 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 a pale pink back with a red eye and a it's and purple front. This is called lavender shad with a with a with a, a, a yellow belly. This is a nice clear water color, man. Ray's in for 50. Mark Levesque is in for 55. 55. We got 55. Can I see 60? They are called purple lavender crankbaits and they look beautiful. Beautiful crankbaits at 55. 55, 55, 50. Can I say 60? We're sitting on 55. 55. Can I see 60? Do they come with hooks, Eric? No hooks, man. Add your own. Okay, add your own hooks. Eric said he did enough by getting them painted. He's got them things shined, <laughs> waxed, and ready to bounce off rocks, baby. 55, 55. Can I All see All right. Start, start calling it down. Going once. Going once. Going twice. Sold for 55. All Travis, right, guys. I, I think, number, thank you, Mark. Of course. Ray comes number, in at 60. 
Travis. Lot number 19, miscellaneous hair jigs. I just start the bidding off at 25 bucks. You're just going to get a shit ton of hair jigs. I don't know. You know, the hooks are all good. Like, I, if, if you want to start experimenting with hair jigs, fuck, 25 bucks. There you go. There's a lot of hair jigs in there. Some are bucktail, some are marabou. Just a random bag of, of hair jigs, Eric. <laughs> Who most made them? Like, most of them are like eighth ounce, one sixteen, stuff like that. But but who made them? Just random, we don't, random hair jigs. Random but, people. Yeah. Random hair jigs. If you want to get into it, I mean, fuck, there's there's two hundred dollars worth of hair jigs right here, retail. Oh wow. Yeah. Pretty good damn price there, bud. Yeah. Let's say that's a pretty good price there, bud. Mm hmm Fine, Pete. I'll take your advice. MJ, $40. <laughs> MJ, I'll give it to you for $40. That's, that's fair. Let's do it. I think you bought some other stuff, so. Oh, shit. Hey Travis. Wow. Yeah. I I honestly think you could probably get 450 if you shave that beard off into a Ziploc bag and sell it because these guys don't want to talk about nothing except for your touch of gray just for men. All right, okay. lot 11. A DT flat again in the lavender shad, not custom DT flat 3 um which is a blue back silver shoulder. A little bit of whisper of orange guys on ebay these go you know and just without custom paint anywhere from 20 bucks to 25 you could check the price yourself but uh you might find them in a tackle shop but they're hard to find so we'll start the bidding since this is like uh so 20 30 we'll start the bidding at 40 for this lot one custom one stop M. Jones, I'm trying, man. Trying to hold up some good stuff. Raise in for 40. Go ahead, JP. We got 40 on the crankbaits. 40 on the crankbaits. I'm sorry, fellas, but I had to start. Don't know what kind of crankbaits they are, but we're sitting on 40. It's a 40. DT flat, DT flat seven, custom painted lavender shad, DT flat three, stock color. One's custom painted and one is stock. That one that is custom painted, Eric, I got to tell you, beautiful looking current bait. Sitting on so, 40. Uh, oh, no, no. We got 50. Small, small mouth, mouth chunky in for 50. 50. Yep. Small mouth chunky for 50. Can we see 55? Looking for 55. Looking for 55. There it is right there. Ray came in at 55. People are motivated to buy things from Epic Eric tonight. We're sitting on 55. Can we see 60? There's two crankbaits. Let's bring it to an even number. 55, 55, 55. Looking for 60. 55, 60. 55, 60. Can I see 60? Sitting on 55. All right. Going once. Going, going twice. twice. Sold for 55 to Ray Albending. All right, lot number 20. I have eight dark Thanks, sleepers, right? miscellaneous <clears throat> sizes, 25 bucks. <clears throat> Those are the mega bass dark sleepers, the Gobi impersonators. These are not only good for just throwing out and reeling in, but you can skip them up underneath docks. He's looking to get 25 for eight. Mark D is in eight. for 25. 25, 25, 25. We're sitting on 25. Can I see 30? Yes, Got 30. Brand new. 30, 30, can I see 35, 30, oh, there's 35, 35, can I see 40, sitting on 35, can I see 40, finally, some motivational buyers, Philip Wade, my man from Vermont, 35, ooh, waves, current and ice from Canada comes in at 40, Travis will make less because it's going to Canada, 40, 40, 40, can I see 45, 40, 40, 45, waves, current and ice is sitting at 40 because he knows that the Mega Bass Dark Sleepers, where's it's at, 40, 40, 40, 40, 
Come on, boys. Philip Wade, bring it up to 45. Keep it in New York. Keep it in Vermont. Four day, four day, four day. Sitting at 40, looking for 45. Let's see if we can keep it in the United States, fellas. We got them sold for 40, but we're there. There we go. Scott, 45. 45. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 45, 45. Can I see 50? Why are 45, we fighting against 45, the Canadians? 50. We brought it up seven times. Let's bring it up eight. We're sitting on 45. We're looking for 50. We brought it back in the United States of America. Bring it back to the red, white, and blue, baby. 45, 45, 45. Can I see 50, 45, 50, 45, 50. Really want to see 50. Anthony G says, I got him in tears. I can barely talk right now. All right. We got it at 45. We're going to let it if anybody misses out on the dark sleepers or the true bass swim baits, you can hit me up on Instagram. 50, 50, 50, 50, 50. Can I get 55? Oh, you're sad. 50, can I get 55? 50, can I get 55? Prime fishing, the new job's great. 50, can I get 55? Come what on. What do we got? We're up to 55, 55, 55, 55, 55. Dan Manger's in for 50 right now. Give it to Dan. Me I'm doing my auctioneering. Give it to Dan. Dan. Dan's Sold got it for 50. 50. I was just called it. All right. Lot 12. Lot 12, a DT7. These are not custom colors, but they're damn good colors. Um, this is kind of like a smoky shad. It's got a smoky gray back, silver shoulders. Nice little bit of glitter in that white side and a whisper orange on the throat. And then the DT3 is like Caribbean shad, man. You can't go wrong with a chartreuse black back. Uh, that's the three. That's a DT flat three and a DT flat seven. Again, these go for 20 to 25. You can check eBay. Uh, they're getting harder and harder to find. It's a great flat side. Catches them. It's, it's got a, a huge following. Huge following. Man, those are two beautiful looking. Are those Rapalas? They are Rapala DT flats. Yeah, yeah they those are bring those nice. Back. Springtime. Mm -hmm. Tight wobbles. Yes. Oh mm -hmm. man, those are beautiful looking crankbaits right there. We got yep. the Rapala flat, baby. What are you looking to get the starting price off at? And by the way, I'm just going to repeat this one more time for you guys. All the new DT, not the DTs, but um, because 50, they do have them, um, take a 50. Life I will take 50. Keep it starting going. Starting at 50, looking at 55. Starting at 50, looking at 55. We're talking about the Rapala no, no. flats. When you're looking for the vibration um, that's tight and nice, you want to buy these Rapalas twice. We're sitting at 50, looking for 55. Real quick, real quick. So the Chick Magnet, that's a flat side. The OG Slim, that's a flat side. Uh, they have my Carter Lips. My Carter Lips, really good crisp action. But the one thing you'll find is that if you're grinding rock like I do, um they wear down really really quick these things last a long a whole lot more longer so anyway smallmouth junkie you know what's up i think we're you missed out on the last one we're sitting on 50 we're gonna get this going pretty quick we're looking for 55 yep. 50 going to 55 50 trying to go to 55 50 trying to go to 55 smallmouth is going for 50 half of 100 looking for 55 55 55 sitting on 50 call it Smallmouth junkie, once, you got it going 50. twice. Sold to smallmouth junkie. JP, how much are Corrado K's going for? Somebody said 150 at Bass Pro Shops. I was starting to bid off on lot number 21. Shimano Corrado, right-handed, 6.2 to 1. Great crank and reel. I wanted 150 for this. Not a scratch on it. I thought that was a fair price. I thought they were like 200 to 225. Fair. I don't know. 150. Who wants what, it? What model is it? The DC model is going for 269. No, it's 200. It's the Corrado K, right? Okay, they're going for 199.99. All right, so 150 is cool. Don't start at me. <laughs> don't give him no grief, everybody. <clears throat> He's done his research. Right? Listen, guys, don't bite the auctioneer, but we're trying to get 150. Central. I had a shit ton of Corrados to sell tonight. If you guys don't want to spend 150 for them, I'm not selling them here. Get another fucking beer. Do another lot here. Wow. <laughs> All right. I'm going to put them up, man. I don't know that anybody's ever seen DT Flats and Brown Trout. But that's what it is. It's not the best crown trout out there, but I'll say this. You could make those easily into a chartreuse crawl, man, with a little bit of nail polish. 
You guys have seen me do it, man. Anyway, they're two DT flats. I don't think the I don't think the marks matter, but you could easily extend those lines, man. But uh, but or if you got brown trout in your neighborhood, that's a great color. Early spring muddy water crankbait. So these are two Rapala DT flats. These are the DT threes. Both are DT threes, and a custom paint. Again, the bodies, you know, no no custom paint. Go for. 20 to 25 each custom paints are a little bit more expensive. Um, I know it's odd, but uh, I'd make those into a spring crawl if it were me. <laughs> and what's the most visible color to back? What, what do they love the most in spring, man? They respond to that color for some reason. Toxic reaction to the beard dye. That's hysterical. That, that was pretty funny, man. Yeah, Brandon Cushel, you're exactly right, man. This would catch them on the rivers for sure. Mountain Dew Trout, no question. That's a great color description, MJ. <laughs> Go for the Dew. Anybody want to put $50 on the brown trout? It's a brown trout and it looks stout. It's a Rapala. Is that a flat? I'll take, also? I'll take, I'll take, I'll take, I'll take 40 for him. Fuck it. Let's go for 30. 30 on the brown That's trout. Are those flats? Are those flats also? Yeah, DT, DT flats, right, yeah. The DT flat yep. with the brown trout stat. He's looking for 30, 30, 30, 30, 30 for the brown trout. 30 for the brown trout. The, <laughs> here we go. We got 30. Can I get 35? We got 30. Can I get 35? He's got a brown trout, and it's not in his pants. He's looking for 35 to make it dance. It's a Rapala flat. And <laughs> We got 30, 35, can I see 30? Robert 35, 35, Robert. can I see 40, 35, can I see 4, 45, 45, 45, can I see 50? No, 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 that's for the broken Corrado. 35, we're sitting on 35, Ray, first winning. guy to do it was Robert Linson, Robert, Robert Linson, Linson. 35, Ray, bring it up to 40, it's a brown trout and it's not in your pants, it's a crankbait that does the wobble and dance, it'll catch bass anywhere you go, because JP's throwing it, what do you know? 35, 35, 35, <laughs> looking for 40. I'm trying, Eric. 35, 40, 35, yeah, 40, doing good, 35 man. 40. All right. Robert Linson was first in. Give Ray uh, a count of uh, 10 uh, Nine, to go up. Uh, eight, eight, or eight, Robert's got seven, six, five. And then you got to let it just oh, marinate. Three. <laughs> two, two, eight. Eight. Out. Okay. Robert's got it. Robert Linson's got it. <laughs> okay, Thank guys. Lot number uh, 20, 22. 10 packs of Z-Man floating worms, 20 bucks starting out. And here they are. Pinks, 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 white, green pumpkin, white, green pumpkin, green pumpkin, and violet. 10 packs, 20 bucks, floating worms. Look for $20 on the pink floating worms when they're uh -huh. spawned. Pre-spawn, they're in that stage where they're just floating around shallow, looking for something to suck up. You got that little pink Z-Man finesse floating worm in pink. That's right, we do. He's got ten packs. He's looking for twenty. That's two dollars a pack. Ten pack. We got twenty. Twenty for Scott Van. Can I see twenty-five? Twenty, twenty, twenty. Looking for twenty-two fifty. Twenty-two fifty. Scott Van's got twenty on the floating worms. They are pink and they do stink. They're Z-Man finesse floating worms for twenty. We got twenty. <laughs> We're looking for twenty-five. Can we get twenty-five on the floating worms, fellas? It's ten packs of Z-Man, which is a great plastic. They float and they're pink. And Scott Vance says he'll give you 20. Can we get 25? Come 20, on, Scott. 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 25, 20, 25, 25, 20. Please give your rod, Travis. 20, 20, 20. Looking for 25. Going once. Going twice. Sold Come the on, Scott Vance. 20, 20 bucks. Son of a bitch. <laughs> what? <laughs> what is he mad? Huh? <laughs> And he's what mad happened? at me. He's mad at me. It's like here I am trying. At least I'm trying. Why is he, why is he mad at you? What do you guys Lot want to see next from the lab, man? Lot oh, number 23. Know. Because Trent was going to offer 25 if you had waited a second. Lot number 23. 21 packs of Get Bit Bait tubes in my favorite color, Dark Melon. 
These are the two and a half inch dark melon, uh, 40 bucks, 21 packs of the get bit bait tubes. These, this tube is what I throw 80% of the time. <laughs> dark melon, two and a half inch. Okay. We got the, these are legit. When I went to Wisconsin and got disqualified from fishing the tournament, we were absolutely smashing them on dark melon tubes, right? That's the best he's got 21 packs for $40. We got 45 for Dan, 45. Can I see 50? 45, 50, 45, 50, sitting on 45. We got 45, bring it up to a half a hunch. 45, 45, 45. Can I see 50? There's a lot of tubes, guys. Good deal right here. 45, ooh, 55. 55, 55, 55. Can I see 60? 55, 60, 60. We got 60. Can I see 65? 60, 60, 60, 65. See, Travis, that's what you need. Shit that's actually going to sell. These guys are motivated when it's good stuff. We got the tubes for 60, looking for 65. 62, 62. Can I see 64? We got 62. Come on, okay, Kevin. You guys like those get bit bait tubes. 65, 65, 65, 65. Bring it to 70. Let me see 70. Let me see 70. We got 65. Well, for 70. We got 65. We're looking for 70. 68, 68, 68. Put <laughs> you straight. 75, 75, 75. Let me see 80. 75, 80. 75, 80. Pin hooks in for 75. Can I see 80? Can I see 80? Can I see 80? Can I see 80? I see 75. Can I see 80? I see 75. You got 21 packs of tubes. Dark melon, 2.75. We're sitting at 80, 80, 80. 80. Can I see 85? 80. Can I see 85? 21 packs, 2.75. Dark melon tubes. We're two sitting at 80. Can or, I see 85? Or maybe they're 275. I don't know. The small ones. We're sitting at 80. Can I see 85? Can I see 85? Can I see 85? Sitting on 80. 81, the smallmouth junkie. A junkie would offer one more dollar. 81, 81, 81. 81. Can I see 85? 81, 85. 81, 85. 2.75 for 81. We're sitting on 81 for that tube fun. You get that uh, Great Lakes finesse flat tube head, man. You shove it up that little tube right there and throw it out there that tube sits perfect <clears throat> 21 packs of dark melons for 81 i'm gonna let it go once i'm gonna let it go twice sold the small mouth junkie for 81 81 small mouth junkie now junkie okay Lot number 24, 15 packs of Get Bit Bait Tubes, Green Pumpkin Copper, the small ones, starting out at $30. Okay, guys, one of the best colors in the Northeast for smallmouth bass when you're throwing a tube is Green Pumpkin Gold Flake. And right now we have 15 packs for $30, 15 for 30, and we're already up to 40. I got 40, can I see 45? 40, can I see 45? Come on, Justin, bring it up to 45. Danny's at 40, Danny's at 40, can I see 45? Green pumpkin, green pumpkin pop, popper. The green pumpkin pop with the gold stop. We got 50, 50, 50, can I see 55? We're sitting at 50, can I see 55? 50 lot 24, to guys, lot we 24. Got, we're up to 60, 60, can I get the 65? We're sitting at 60, can I get the 65? The green pumpkin pop with the gold stop. It's a 2.75 and you throw it until you die. We're sitting on the 60 and I'm looking for 55. 60, 60, 60. Can I get 65? Hooks at 60. Fish with Wheezy wants to bring it to 65. 60. Let's go. 60. Hook fishing. He hasn't won yet tonight. 60. Sold. Fish it fish it with Weezy's on. He bid. Go, Weezy. Go, Weezy. Oh, I'm sorry, MJ. We called it. <laughs> All right, lot number 25, starting at $50. This is a mega bag of Gajo stick baits, miscellaneous. So we have some of their Ned rigs in here. We have uh, a bunch of Ned rigs. We got we got their Gajo the stick. Blue highlight. Mm -hmm. A huge ass bag of Gajo sticks right there. $50 starting out. And we got some more of the Ned Rigs as well there. All great colors. A real nice supply 
of stick baits from Gajo. And that's going to be lot number 25, 50 bucks. All right, next up is the man's right, pogo shad. We don't have JP. Let's see what, what comes in here. I'm just, I just, I just held it up real quick. And I have a bonus on that lot. Justin.r is in for 50 right now. That's a huge bag of sticks. Go ahead, Eric. Let's see that pogo. There's a pogo shad. Pogo shad for everybody. Oh. Rare color. That's a That's unique bone. color. It sure is. Bone orange with a little chartreuse throat. Justin, since I don't yeah, see any other bids right now, we're going to give you that for 50 since JP stuck, snuck away. And I'm throwing the smaller size chrome in. Justin, so it's a dollar. you got it for 50, lot number 25. Double package. There you go. That's a hell of a price, Travis. Yeah. Which which lot went for 50? Uh, lot number 25, the Gajo sticks. And who'd it go to? Man's Pogo Shed. Um, Justin.r. No. Justin.r. Okay. For those of you guys that don't know about the Pogo Shad, hard thumping, that tail wide wobbling. This is not a tight action little lipless crankbait. The unique part about this is when you stop it, it spirals like a tube, which is kind of like a dying action. So anyway, there's some people that collect these, man. Retro bassing cow would be all over the Pogo Shads. I might have to save it for them if there's no good bids. I don't know. They usually go for like 25 bucks if you can find them on eBay. I'll start the bidding for both at uh, 25 tonight. I'm feeling, feeling, feeling generous. 25 <clears throat> for two pristine examples of a pogo shad by man's. Let it marinate. Let it marinate. We'll go to lot number 26. This is my full box labeled Bay Cinco. So this is a uh, dedicated for 24. No, Most people of these 25. Are inch. These are yeah, all 25. That's what he meant. Pato or uh, uh, where am I? Chesapeake Bay colors. The ones I throw. Yeah, you're a lot. gonna have to I'm hold gonna... that back for a second, real quick, because now the bidding has started for the pogo. We got okay. 30. So now we got. Okay, so we got we 30. got we got, we got, we got Eric's right. going for 20, 20 for 30, 30, 30, 30. Can I get thirty five? Got... Epic E. Epic E right. wants to sell them things for thirty five. We're sitting on thirty. He's looking for thirty five. Thirty, thirty, thirty. <laughs> Travis is trying to bite off Epic Eric's nose. Thirty five for the pogos <laughs> to dedicated endurance. We got thirty five. Can I see forty? Thirty five, thirty five, thirty five. Can I get to forty? There's two. Let's make it even two. Thirty five to forty. Thirty five to forty. We're sitting on thirty five. We're looking for forty. Tell Travis to put Inko back in his pants because Eric's trying to make those whatever kind of crankbaits they are dance. Eight, We're sitting at 35. Can I get five, to 40? Seven, eight, nine, All right. Eight, call it. Call it. Call it. Call it. We'll, we'll so move it dedicated fast. To 14, endurance for 35. 15, 17, 18. So each tray, well, one tray has 19 Cinco's. So there's a bunch of them for 50 bucks. These are uh, really good colors. I'm trying to show you them. These are the small ones. There's, these are what, three inch? There's just some three inch of the green in there. That's the only tray that's three. The rest are all five inch. Big ass tray. 50 bucks. Who's in? Let's go. All right, guys, Let's here go. we go. It's a Travis Manson Tidal Water. Lot number 26. Tidal Water Bay Sanko Box. He's looking for 50 bucks for the miscellaneous Senkos. There's three inch, there's four inch, there's five inch. He throws them on the Chesapeake Bay. He catches four pounders all day. It's a miscellaneous bag of Yamamoto Senkos. Who wants to throw down 50 bucks? Oh, yeah. They're original Senkos, too. They're not the ones you buy now where they're stiff. These ones are limp and they'll break right. on one fish. They are $50. We're looking for 50 on the Senkos, 50 on we the Senkos. We got a few more lots, Grannies. We got 75. 75. 75. Looking for 50 on the Senko. All right. I don't know if anyone's going to take those. I don't mind not selling them. I just threw it out there, you know. All right. Next up is right, a. This is my grand finale. Oh, Eric. Nah, man. What? Come on. What? I don't have much more. 
We'll just hold off a little bit. Lot number, 20, lot number 27. Right. Mojo Bass, Glass Rod, MGC, 72HM, $100 shipped. So it's a seven foot two, medium heavy, glass Mojo Bass Rod. I'm going to assume it's for throwing crankbaits. There we go. Yeah, so this one here, I'll show it to you. It's the Mojo Glass. It's uh, I have labeled spinner baits on there, um, but it definitely is a great cranking stick as well. And, uh, He's looking to get 100 bucks out of this rod, fellas. It's a Mojo Bass, and it's made out of glass. It'll go out and kick a large mouth ass. He's looking for $100. Oh, yeah. Let's get 100 on that rod, 100 on that. There we go, 100 for Pete Chabowski. Okay. He's <laughs> yeah, making right. a joke. <laughs> and it's in excellent condition, too. It's not just – it's not used and abused at all. I don't know what these retail for. I thought 100 bucks is a fair price, so. It's going to cost me 20 to ship. Has Jablowski ever bought anything off this auction? You will never buy anything from this auction. Yeah, because he'd have to give out his address, and he knows after what he said last week, I'd be there. <laughs> <laughs> what do you guys, you want 100 bucks for this glass rod? It's a it's a crankbait <laughs> rod, it's a spinnerbait rod, and it's it's ready to throw them, them crankbaits that Epic Eric just pulled all day long. Oh, it's seven foot two, medium heavy, made out of glass, kicking past ass. Hundred dollars. Come on, baby. Hundred, oh, hundred, hundred. Put it to the side, Travis. Nobody wants it. All right. That's fine. We'll sell it somewhere else. <clears throat> All right. For those of you guys who uh were interested in the uh tiny clash, I got it in a special run color. Ooh. I got a couple of them, so I'm willing to let one go. It's a low float tiny clash. That's the DRT Tiny Clash. And this color is, it was the hooked up tackle special run color called Sake Bomber. And uh, best way to describe it, light green back and uh, a little bit of, uh, well, let me just hold it up. Can you guys see it? Light green back, small little white stripe down the side. I like that. It lights up in clear water. Yeah. And so for those of you guys who don't know the DRT, the DRT does a lot of things. It could be a glide bait. It could be a, uh, a crank down. I love it in crank down mode. Uh, the tail, you switch the tail over here. You switch for both modes. Um, it's like a whale tail. So if you can imagine a whale tail going up, like up, like up, like up, curled up, that's the crank down mode and tail down where the fins kind of point down is actually glide mode. And it's a TK, um, Tiny Clash, and I'm throwing in, and you'll thank me later. I'm not even going to tell you what those hooks are, but you'll thank me later. You should change out your hooks on your Whopper Flopper and use these. So Travis, just that's put a that box to the side, college. bud. What's that, bud? Just put you that box miss, to the side. You will miss. I'll take you will that. You miss a lot, Fuse. So I'm starting this. <laughs> yeah, right. It's it's a hundred bucks uh, for the for the TK, um, in that special run color of Sake Bomber, Sake Bomber plus the free package of hooks. And the hooks are worth the knowledge in the hook pack is worth a hundred bucks for your tournament fishing. You don't even know about it, JP, and nor do you, Travis Manson. I'll turn you on to it. This is the kind of stuff. That, Ant like, said 120, Eric. It's straight up like money. And this I'll say this about that. The hooks, the hooks were part of um 125 on that now, Eric. Over fuck. I don't want to overstate. They were part of at least. Thirty-seven thousand dollars in winnings. Yeah, they put fish in the boat. All senior time. It did not, did not, did not miss them. Still my fucking rods. You still right, my so, rods. Oh my god! <laughs> so Ryan Dahl is up to. Ryan Dahl's up to one hundred twenty-five. Can you, hey, the, uh, Jake, whatever your freaking name is, and anybody that knows the TK, um, one accessory I would recommend is to get the transfer tail on this tiny clash it makes it when you're walking if you're not in touch with the reel so like when you give it a fast turn that bait will turn and then if you hesitate it'll turn around and sometimes hook on the front um so the transfer tail makes it a little bit easier to work the bait in glide mode uh you can get a deeper diving lip 
Um, funny story about this bait. I was cranking rip rap with Scooter Lily. We were practicing on Smith Mountain Lake. The first fish that I caught on this bait uh, was like a four in practice. I laughed my ass off because it took me about 10 casts. Um, with, um, with Austin Neary, you can see us work this bait. Uh, for multiple 20 pound bags, you know, some were, I think the, the best bag was around 27. Uh, it was in a high mountain reservoir in uh, North Carolina, fishing with Austin from Dreamcatchers Fishing. You can watch that video. That was pretty cool. Um, so it's a super versatile bait, guys. You could do what's called dead walking. Uh, you can weight the bait. They do make a high float, but I think the most versatile is the, uh, is the low float model, which is this one. So what are we up to, JP? I, I was I saw 125 before you went on that explosive rant, which was awesome. I learned a lot of how to use my reel and crank to get it to turn one way and crank to go the other. But I saw 125, so we got 125 on that beautiful glide. 125 on that beautiful glide. So it's a light. It's a very thin strip of light purple, green olive shoulders fading. It lights up when it's in the water. Uh, I think uh, Frank Scalet said it's best. Sometimes you have to see a color in the water to understand what it's going to do. So, so somebody said 125, 125, 125, okay, 125, can we get 130? 125. Can we get 130? Can we get 130? We're sitting on 125 for that beautiful glide. Throw it in a tree. What do you know? Big glides go where all bass go. Seven pounders from under a dock's going to clock that glide like it's wearing socks. He's sitting on 125 and he's looking for 130, baby. Can I see 130, 130, 130, 130 sitting on 125? Guys are pissed off. I said I wanted them boxes. 125, 125. <laughs> 125, call it. 125 for Ryan Dahl. Called it. Sold. Sold right, to Ryan Dahl for 125. All right, guys. Here's something interesting. Lot number 20, 29. We have two mercury beanies red starting bid thirty dollars but i'm also going to throw in this multi-tool the mercury camouflaged multi-tool it's got like screwdrivers and knives and shit come on jp help me out here let's get all right this here sold. we go guys we got the two beanies bucks. this is this is amazing gadget <clears throat> This is a beautiful multi-tool. They call it a multi-tool because it's not only a plier. It's got a cup holder. It's got a bottle popper. It's got a corkscrew. It's got a little tiny Swiss Army knife that comes out of the side. It's got a file to sharpen your hooks. Just got to take a little look. It's the multi-tool by Mercury. It's camouflage handles so that when you drop it in the woods, gone she goes. But you got your red hat on so you don't get shot in the ass. We got two beanies and a multi-tool, and we're looking for 30. Two hats and a pair of plaques for 30 bucks. Let's go. Can we get 30, 30, 30, 30, 30? Nice little Mercury gift bag here. Can I get 30? Can I get 30? Two beanies and a pair of pliers for 30. Man, them two beanies are worth 30 bucks. Ooh, there you go. MJ for 30. There you go, MJ. Hell yeah. Give it to him. I yeah, go. 35. I want the boxes back. I'll give you 35 of them. <laughs> give it to MJ. MJ for 30. MJ's got it. All right. Lot number 30. Yeah. Z-Man Miscellaneous starting out at 30 bucks. Oh, wow. It's a hell of a miscellaneous bag. I'll go through it real quick. Lot number 30, $30. I don't know what, what's in here, but we got those. The craws. We got some hogs. I mean, just. A lot of them, different different miscellaneous finesse baits. By it's a thirty dollar lot. <clears throat> yeah, there's a miscellaneous. There's a bunch of bait baits in here. Like plastics. We've got Neds. We've got Crows. We've got no Neds. No Neds. These are all like bugs, ticklers, uh, Crows. Just you know, just little perfect little jig trailers for you guys. Does it chop up buds and lines? Carl's going off the deep end tonight. Here we go, guys. We got the miscellaneous Z Man pack. Tickler Z's, the Hog Z's, and the Little Craws, baby. 30, 30, 30, 30 for the Z Man value pack. You can it's put these value drop pack shots and put them on Ned's. $30 and put you ahead. It's a Fuck variety it, go to pack. 20, bud. Go to 20. See who wants this. Let's $20. Move oh, no. There you go. Dan Manger for 30. Now we got 35 for currents and oh, ice. Good. 
See, you're yelling at me. Oh, you're dropping no. the price. Here we go, boys. 35, 35. Can I see 40? Can I see 40? Can I see 40? 35, 35, 35. For somebody bring it back to the USA. Waves and Current wants it for 35 today. Oh, yeah. Can I get 40? Can I get 40? 40 to Dan Manger. He's the man. Thank he brought man. it back. Let's right go. Right oh, That's yeah. 40, 40, 40, 40. Can I see 45? Can I see 45? Can I see 45? Going once, going twice. Sold to Dan Manger. For 40. Nice. How are you, crazy kids? I'm out of plastic baggies to put stuff in. <laughs> How much was that? Who was it for? <laughs> Whoa. J JP, how much was lot number 30 and how much? 40 to Dan Manger. Dan Manger. Sure. Okay, real quick, guys. Lot 31 is four packs of owner mosquito size one hooks. There's eight of them, and they're five bucks. Lot 31, five bucks. There's four packs of size one owner mosquitoes. Eight five dollars. Four packs of owners. Eight packs of mosquitoes. Five dollars. Five dollars for the hooks, boys. Who wants? Listen, somebody that already bought something, just throw five more dollars in and get the hooks. Put God it in band. the same box. There you go. Got five. Band for five. Perfect. <clears throat> oh, you want me to get that up higher? We got five. We got five. I mean, give me seven. It's going to cost me four to ship it. Yeah, he already bought something, though. But can we get seven? Can we get seven? We got five. Can we get seven? Let's we got five. buy something. Let's yeah, buy Scott something. Did, yeah. Give it to him. Give it to All me. Right, there you go, Scott. You got you it. Got Five it, dollars. <laughs> All right. Oh, shit. Guys, you're going to love this one. This is lot number 32. This is a St. Croix Mojo Bass, the new handle, the new style. This is a 7 foot 10, medium light, extra fast. A great rod for Ned rigging, drop shotting, dragging a Ned. $100. Lot number 32. Lot number 32. Where is 32? 32, 32, 32. Here we go. Right here. New in the package. Mojo Bass. 710. Medium light. Extra fast. It's going to be a great finesse rod. It's got the new handles. I'm not going to take it out of the bag. $100. Smallmouth Junkie with 100. Can I see 110? We got 100. Can I see 110? 110. 110. It's seven foot ten, medium light. It'll throw hair jigs all day and night. We got a hundred. We're looking for 110. 110. 110. The waves current and ice. Oh yeah, baby. Over there to the red and white. He's got 110. Can I see one money? Bring her back to the US, guys. Let's bring it back, baby. Bringing it back over to our side of the river. Lot we got number a 110 32. looking for 120. <laughs> 115 to Captain Nostrand. 115, 115. Can I get 120? Can I get 120? Come on, wave your current. 120, 120. Come on, Captain. Bring it to 125. We got it at 120. We're looking for 125. 125 to Slumpy the Grumpy. 125 looking for 130. 125 looking for 130. 125 looking for 130. Justin, you're a little late. 125. 130. <laughs> Waves current and ice going to Canada. 130. 130 looking for 135. Come on, Eric. 130. 130. 135. All right. 130. 135. Bring it back over here <laughs> for 135. Sitting on 130. Waves current and ice ain't 1 1 tonight. Let's not let it happen now. We're looking for 135. He's sitting on 130. 135, the slumpy, the grumpy. 135, looking for 140. Come on, slump, you got this. 140. 135, looking for 140. Come on, current, bring it back up. They'll bring one, bring it to 140. <clears throat> well, they want you to it's autograph. An OG Travis. minus one, just for Pete. This is just for Pete Jablowski. Says I never bring up any OG minus ones. And it has the hooks that I would throw on it. A red Gamakatsu number five. <laughs> and. You've got a little bit of a uh, custom paint by Epic Eric on there. I put the black shad dot and the two little red dots on the belly. Now you know what I do. There you go. Pete, this one's for you. Go ahead and start the bidding, Pete, at 25 bucks. Okay, the rock is slumpy gumpy for 135. OG minus one, double stamped. Man's on one side if the camera will pick it up. It's going to be tough to see because of the glitter. 
and the baby minus one on the other. What's Who different about that baby? And I glued some Puppy bigger eyeballs on there. Like, this, one, this one has touched my hands. Anyway, one of the best colors on the upper bay right there. Blue back, white belly, probably because they think it's crabbish. I don't know why. I don't know why. This is uh, yeah, it's tackle crafts favorite bait for sure. TK, jump on in anytime. Slam hard. Plus, you know what I'm going to do to sweeten a lot for Pete Jablowski? Twenty five bucks plus. I'm sending you all these DTH free, Pete. And there's five of them in there, so you get you a baby Pete minus one and eight. Pete. You want Pete to buy that yeah, from you? Well, Pete? Said, you think Pete's got well, some sort of bank account? That says Pete Jablowski. You think you're gonna get a, a Venmo from Pete said, Jablowski? There's no, no way. He said, he, he said that he says he, I, I wouldn't put one up. I just want to Who's show that I'm playing ball tonight. What are you talking about? Grabbing the fire tonight. <laughs> Grumpy, you got that rod for 135. Small mouth junkies in for 45 for the DT8s and the baby minus one. That's a good price and that's a hell of a deal. Nice. 45 small mouth junkies started the bidding. We get the 45 can I see 50, 45, 50, 45, 50. I'm sorry, Eric, but I don't know a lot about crankbaits. We got the 45 going to 50. It's a beautiful looking blue back square bill crankbait that Pete Chablowski no. says. Is good. <laughs> <laughs> this is an original man's baby minus one. It runs one foot deep. Okay, let's pretend you're in Ticonderoga. 55. Right, we got 55. 55 looking for all that beautiful milk foil. You're around all that beautiful milfoil, right? And you're looking for a super shallow crankbait because those fish 60 are looking up, right? right? Now well, we're at 60. Can I get you're 70? You're burning this thing. You're burning <laughs> this thing as fast as you can. And the nice thing about the OG ones is they don't blow out. You can't wind this. You can wind it as fast as you want. I don't know. I've never been able to blow it out. I don't have an eight, eight one to whatever reel. So this is for Brett. So far, Brett's got 60. 65. Brett's 65 right. to smallmouth junkie. Come on, Brett, bring it to 70. We got 65 to smallmouth junkie. Brett Karn right for 70. Brett really wants that. And when he's hitting the tour, 70 to Brett, 70 to Brett. Can I see 75? We got 70. Can I see 75? We got 70. Can I'm I see 75? It. Brett Karn right, 70 bucks. Oh, smallmouth junkie. I'm sorry. You got to go up five. Karn right gets it for 70. Ooh, Karn right got it. All right, lot number 33, Z-Man Finesse Shads, 14 packs. I'm just showing you the guys the colors. We're starting now at $40. That's a double pack there. $40. Lot number 32, 33, 33, 33, lot 33, sorry. Lot number 33, looks like it's a bunch of, pack. It's a bunch so of flukes by Z-Man. The Z-Man flukes. He's looking for 40. 40 for the flukes. Shads, not the flukes. Z-Man flukes. Shads. There's a double pack. Oh, Come Brett on, wants guys. to know what lot that was and how many DT8s. There's 16. a double pack. That's, this is 17. A huge, lot 17, Brett. Lot 17. Okay, so we got the we got the Z fellas. We got to keep it going. We got the Z mans. They look like a fluke, and there's um fourteen packs for forty dollars. If 40 nobody 40. buys these, I'm probably gonna keep them. Shit. There you go. Right. Forty dollars. Forty. Right. Can I get forty-five? You guys are really pissing off Travis tonight. He's got it for forty. Can I get forty-five? Anthony seven 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 said forty. Can I see forty-five? We got forty. Can I see forty-five? He said if it was selling for forty, he'd keep them for himself. He's got it at forty. I need forty-five, 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 forty-five. We got it at forty. Anthony seven seven seven's got it at forty, and we need it at forty-five. Can I see it at forty? I see it at forty-five. It's, it's I got I got family stuff. I can't stay long. We could have a little mini auction next week, maybe. No, we're finishing this, and you're using that as an excuse. I no, I it's my it's, it's my daughter's last night in town before she goes back out to California. So I gotta what hang. Do you sell these for forty dollars. Don't, so don't commit to an auction when you want to get off at eight fifty nine because you sold your goddamn. I have plenty more I could sell. Believe me. I do. Are you kidding me? I couldn't stay. I couldn't stay on auctions for the next month 
and sell it all. That's a fact. Where are we, we at? Get with the, we get auction every Monday. Who got it for 40? Uh, Anthony777. Yep. Good job. Travis, I just want to let you know, and I'm not meaning to put you on the spot, but if yeah. you start treating me like shit or Eric gets off the auction, you're losing your auctioneer. So let's remember, I'm helping uh -oh. you out here and I'm falling through my ass, okay? <laughs> Lot number 34, River Rock Custom Tubes, starting out at $35. Um, I'm going to show you real quick. Whoa, 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 whoa. What? River, let me see what color those are. These are the flipping tubes. These are the uh, oh, okay. orange solid heads. Okay. Okay, one, two. Three green pumpkins. I'm going quick. These are good tubes, guys. I'm just never going to throw them. These are the River Rock flipping tubes. They come with a solid head. There's a double okay. pack there. Soft bottom. And so it's like $35. There's a lot of packs in here. 35 bucks is a hell of a deal for these. I get absolutely nothing for helping out with this auction. Uh, Niagara for sale. Three do bag it. of tackle boxes, you freak. I, I do it because he's my friend, and that's what you do for your friends. So listen, we got the River Rock tubes with the solid head. Looking for 35. Let me see 35 for the flipping tube. Flip the tube in the milfoil kitchen. 35 kitchens. bucks Ray. for all these tubes. Ray with 35. Can I see 40? We got 35. Can I see 40? 35, 40, 35, 40. Can I see 40? We got the five. Ray's got the 35. Wait, Chuck, man, you don't have to register. You just... Send us your Venmo and PayPal and say I'm in. I think Eric. that's what he's asking. Eric. Eric. Yes. Look. Yes. Look. Yes. What's that? Big what is Gino. that? It's Big Gino. Yeah. If you don't fish him, tell him he's got a home for him. <laughs> All right, where are we at with the tube? Uh, Bass and Burgers down. going for 40. We got 40 looking for 45. We got 40, we're looking for 45. All right, Bass and Burger, that's cool. We'll give it to you for 40. Okay, Bass and Burger. I got another 40. Shimano Corrado. Shit, Carl. Sorry, Carl. I got another Shimano Corrado 6.2 right hand, but nobody wants to spend 150 for the real soul. We'll just skip that. Lot 36, <clears throat> I have nine packs of Kitex 2.8. I'm sorry, what is this? 3.8s. I wrote that wrong. Uh, $27 starting bid. I guess these are all going to be the IU colors. These are the 3.8. I got nine packs IU, $27. That's a really good deal, you guys. Those are the 3.8. They are beautiful for the A-Rig. <laughs> they are in the IU color. They're the 3.8. We got 27. We got 27. Can I see 37? They are Kitech. They are injected with squid juice. 27, I'm looking for 37. 27, I'm looking for 37. 27, I'm looking for 28. 28, looking for 30. 28, looking for 30. 30, 30 looking for 35. 30 looking for 35. 30 looking for 35. Come on, guys. They're high techs. 40, 40, 40. 40 looking for 50. 40 what, looking for what 50. What happens here? What's going on with the 40? Let's go to 45. 45 for 50. 45 looking for 50. They're the Kitex. They're the best. They smell like squid and they beat the rest. We got 45 and we're looking for 50. Come on, boys. They're in the IU color. One of the best colors ever made. 45 looking for 50. 45 looking for 50. 45 looking All right, for 50. Let's so who did 45 first? Bass in grass. That's it. He got it. Bass in grass. Bass in grass. <laughs> you got her. How much? 45. Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna try this. Lot number 37. I got 80 pound power pro. There is, it's a 1500 yard spool, but I wrote on here I used 400 yards. So you got a thousand yards of 80 pound Power Pro, 50 bucks green. Is that a used spool? It is. It's a 1500 yard spool. I took 400 yards off of it. 
Carl says he'll give you 35 bucks for it. Well, if anyone else wants to bid, they can. <laughs> Otherwise, Carl can have that. 35, 35, oh, wait, 35. Is Carl talking about, Carl was trying to bid on something else, too. Angler's Choice Trophy. He was talking about the Angler's Choice Trophy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Somebody says he'll give you two bucks. <laughs> Where are we at with this, Carl? Is this you? Do you want 35 on this? Yes, I have a line counter when I put the braid on so I know how much I took off. Oh, for the previous. So Jason nice. says 20 bucks. Jason, are you in for 20? Can we get you up a little higher? Bass and grass. You want to know how to pay? You're going to do the PayPal account at Travis Manson, or you can do the Venmo account at Travis Manson Smallmouth Crush. Please, in your description, write down your name, your address, and your complete email for the love of God. All right. John says 35 bucks. <laughs> Let's give it to John. All right, that one's not on my list, so you got to write that down, Travis. 37 got cut off. All right, All right guys. Water, bud. I got to call it. All right, Eric. Well, All right, thanks. man. Thank uh, you, everybody, man. This is awesome. Dude, I hope we can uh, do another smaller one one day because I didn't even start. Another smaller one. I would have been for the duration. Two hours in. That's why I started early. Really disappointing you, bud. Could have used you tonight. I know, bud. I I about it. I thought you were going to do another small one next week, man, because you're trying to get to like break stuff up into smaller bay. No, we got a lot of good stuff coming I, up, I, and I'm say bag going. like I was from Wisconsin. What do you got? Uh, we got a lot of good stuff coming. What'd up. What'd you say? We have a lot of good stuff. We got coming a lot up. of what's coming up? Good ones. What are you talking about? I tell you, I don't, I don't even know what I'm talking about, man. I got. I got I got, I got right, it, man. I got it. I don't get to spend much time with her, man. Travis, right, go get it you in. got go, it, man. Go, Thank go. you, everybody. I appreciate right. it, man. Thank you. Uh, all Tra right. Travis, Let's you got a guy trying to get you 225 for both or 250 for both them reels. For the uh, – You guys just want to look at the bait wall while I'm gone? Do you want me to no. keep the bait wall live while I'm gone? No. Okay, wants, sure. Wants, I mean, wants. sometimes people like looking at that stuff, man. Captain Nostra says he'll give you right, 250 for out, both everybody. Corrados. Thank you, man. 275, I'll give them both of them, the <laughs> six to twos. So you negotiate that with them. We're going to keep going because we got a lot of stuff to cover. Lot number 38 <coughs> is three packs of Cortland Master Braid, 50 pound, but these are 300 yard black spools. Okay, guys. $50. This is this is three separate packs of three yard spools. You're looking to get sixty dollars, sixty dollars, sixty dollars, sixty dollars, sixty dollars for the three. That means you got it right. Twenty, forty, sixty, twenty bucks a pack. <laughs> twenty bucks a pack for a total of sixty. Sixty dollars for the Cortland braid. It is fifty pound, three hundred yards long. Let's go, guys. A uh, fifty pound test. Three hundred yard spools, all brand new. <clears throat> Someone's going to grab this. 60, 60. Put up the 60. Put up the 60. As to a pound, we, it was 50. Come on, There's guys. We can do it. Yeah, Trenton wants to know when we're going to sell the five pound braid. Not going to happen. <laughs> I do do a little frog fishing, Neil Bone. It's good braid. I wouldn't, I use it like every, I'm 100% sold on it. So I love it. Um, We can put that in the side for now, I guess. All right. We have a lot to go through here. <clears throat> lot number 39. I have a Z-Man Big TRD Yoga Pants, nine packs, $25. $25 for nine packs of the Big TRD. The Big TRD and the Black Yoga P. 
We're looking for 25 for the nine pack, 25 for the nine packs. It's the big TRD, not the little TRD. That's right. Yoga it's the pants. big TRD and the yoga nine pants. pants. We got 25. 25. 25 looking for 30. 20. Now we got 30, 30 looking for 35. We got 30, we're looking for 35. 30 looking for 35 on the nine pack of the yoga pant. Yoga pant, the big TRD. We got the 30, 30, 30 looking for 35. 30 looking for 35. All right, what we got? Thirty dollars, a small mouth junkie. We're gonna move this along. All right, small mouth shit. Thirty five. God dang it, small mouth junkie. You got it. <clears throat> we gotta give it a little bit, bud. Lot forty. Z Man TRD miscellaneous eleven plus packs. Thirty dollars. Okay, so these are your finesse TRDs. I got eleven packs here. Plus, because they're doubled up, some of them. Um, the deal, the deal, definitely a doubled up pinks. Perch, pink, pink, doubled up pink. Green pumpkin, doubled up green pumpkin, tripled up green pumpkin, green pumpkin, a few purple rains in there. Um, $30 for lot number 40. Lot of Z-Man TRDs, 30 bucks. We're going to start at this lot of a bunch of TRDs. These are the normal size TRDs, and we're looking to start at 30. Looking for 30, for 30 on the TRDs. They are the small ones, the ones that get bit. You got to throw them. There we go. Trenton C for 30. Can I get 35? We got 30. Can I see 35? We got 35. Can I see 40? We got 35. Can I see 40? 35, 40, 35, 40. Looking for 40. Sitting on 35. Looking for 40. Got to let it sit. Got to let it skate. Got to let, let it skate. What are you talking about? Ned's marinate. We, we wanted to marinate so it turns as brown as that beard. 35, 35, 35 for 40. Wow. 35 looking for 40. Let's let it go for a little bit. And um, get ready to call it. I'm going to bring out lot number 41. It's miscellaneous Senkos. I got $100 starting bid. Oh, Sold for 35 to Jared. 35 Jared's got her. See, these guys, you, this is what they do. They wait till like they sold and they put it up so you get pissed. I'm on to them. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Lot 41, miscellaneous Cinco's $100. I'll go through them all real quick. It's just a bunch of Cinco's, guys. And you know what? I'll just throw in the Bay Cinco box, all of these for 100 bucks. Screw it. That's a hell of a price. This is the deal of the night right here. It's $100 Cinco box to get you down in the grass. I shouldn't even do this. This is oh for a hundred dollars. Whatever. So lot, what is this? Lot 41. There you go. hundred dollars. Oh murder. 41 and 26. All right, let's just go through some of these so you see what they are. Can I see 110? 110. 110. That's not 110, just 110. We're looking for 120. We're at 110. We're looking for 120. Come on, oh murder. Bring it back up. We're at 110. We're looking for 120. <clears throat> Sitting at 110. Holy shit. Yeah, there's a ton of Cinco's. There's, these are like triple packs. Like, this is ridiculous. This is a, the deal of the night right here, guys. 120. We got 120. We got 120. Can I see 130? Can I see 130? We're on 120. I can I see 130. <clears throat> <clears throat> This is what you're getting. So let's give it a little bit. This is a heck of a deal. 120, 120, 120. Can I get 130? 120 to 130. Looking for 130. Oh, murder. Oh, murder. Evan from Oh, murder. Put 120. I'm looking for 130. Come on. Let's do it. There's 130. 130 to Tommy. 130 to Tommy. Can I get to 140? Look at all them Sankos, guys. It's a really good deal. They're $9 a pack. 130, 130 for 140. Come on, Evan, spend a little bit of that money. 
130, 130, 130. Can I get to 140? While you're – let's talk about the next one. Lot 42, Mojo Bass, 745. 145. Can I get to 155? Lot number 42 is the Mojo Bass, 73 medium light. Extra fast, great drop shot, Rod. This is brand new, starting out at hundred dollars. We're at one forty-five. Can I get to one fifty? One fifty, one fifty, one fifty on the Senkos. We're at one forty-five. Can I get to one fifty? It's a bunch of Senkos. It's a bunch of bass growers. It's a bunch of bass growers. The number one bait in the country. All right, hold on. Let's give it to Omerta. Okay, Omerta's got it. One forty-five. That's a good deal, guy. All right, this is the uh, Samata the says he'll give you a hundred for the rod. Mojo seven three medium light extra fast. Seven three medium light extra fast. We got one ten. Uh, Omerta, that was lot number forty one. We got one twenty from Warren County. Shady, no seven inch Senkos this time. This is lot number 42, Mojo Bass, seven three, medium light, extra fast. Warren County Bass for 120. Can we see 140? Can we see 140? We got 125. 125, we'll give her 130. 130. 130 for Justin Jr. Can we see 135? What do we 130, got? 130, 130, 130. Can I see 135? Can I see 135? All right. Who won the? Uh... Uh, Justin Jr. for 130. The Mark, that, is, that 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 motor cover was a DD twenty six. I got Captain at one thirty five. Where are we at? Oh, you got Captain at one thirty five. Okay. Does Justin Junior want to come up to one forty? We're at one thirty five. Let's bring it to one forty. 135, bring it to 140. My computer must be lacking because every time I sell something sold, instantly it comes in with a higher price. We got Captain No Strunt. <clears throat> Mark D said he'll take the motor cover for $100. All right. We got a lot of stuff going on here. Let me find that motor cover. All right. Yep. I had it listed for $100. Um, who wants that? Mark D, you got the motor cover. Mark D. And then let's get back to that rod. Let's call that rod so we can move on with our lives here. Lot number 12, Mark, was the uh, motor cover. So just put that in the description. Guys, make sure you put your shipping address in your Venmo and your PayPal comments or email me at tspeedm at yahoo.com. Tell me what lot you want and all that too. Um, let's call that rod, bud. All right, 135, the Captain Nostrand. All right. Oh, let's see if we can sell this. Oh, I see a spinning reel coming up, too. Nice. All right. I got an unopened pack of Cortland Master Braid, 1,500 yards of 8-pound moss green. That will start out at $90. <laughs> It's a really good deal. It was this eight pound master braid and moss green for 90 bucks. 1500 yards, 1500 yards, 15 football fields, eight pound. It's green, it's master braid, it's eight pound, and he wants 90. And we got 90. Can I get 95? We got now I got 100. 100. Can I see 110? 100 to Brian Winston. See, can I see 110? <laughs> The TRDs. So if you're referring 120, to 120, 120, 120, can I see 130? Smallmouth Junkie said 120. Can I see 130? Jared, Smallmouth Jared, Junkie said 120. Can 40. I see 130? Jared, lot number 40. 
small mouth junkies got it at 120 can i see 130 can i see 130 can i see 130 i got 120 can i see 130 130 130 130 130 130 can i see 140 all right give it a second and we'll see where that ends um next up lot so this was lot 44 guys the sh or 43 lot 43 the master braid where are we at there bud small mouth junkie at 120 120 mm -hmm. small mouth junkie let's do it all right all right lot number 44 uh. is a shimano stratic 3000 in very good condition we're going to start that out at 175 Okay, guys, these are great reels. It's a 3000 series, the larger spool, so you can drop on them fast. It's a Shimano Stratic 3000, looking for 175. It's Brand new, that thing got, was close to 300. It's even got braid on it, ready to go. And that thing's loaded up and ready to drop. 175, 175, 175. Can I see 175 for the 3000 series? Stratic by Shimano. 175. Dude, I'm dying. I'm sick. <clears throat> We're almost getting through this. Mm -hmm. I figured somebody would appreciate a Stratic showing up on here. 175, 175, the J Jay Flocka. Flocka. Oh, two people at 175. Let's get it to 185. Let that marinate. I got lot number 45 is eight packs of. Yamamoto Fat Icas. We're getting there, bud. One eighty to Pat B. Pat B is at one eighty. We're gonna keep going and just give it a second for that lot forty four, which is the Shimano Stratic. Lot 45, eight packs of fat Icas, 25 bucks. It's going to be black and blue and green pumpkin, I'm sure. And there they are. Black and blue, green pumpkin, black and blue, green pumpkin, black and blue, black and blue, green pumpkin, green pumpkin. Eight packs of fat Icas. What are those? Those like those are them freaking solid tubes or whatever? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We started that out at 25. <laughs> Pat B's 180 for that reel. Mm-hmm. Okay. You want to you want to say that or what? Um. Yeah. It's that's good. We'll work. Okay. We'll Pat B, you got it for 180. All right. We gotta get rid of these fat icas. We got 25. Can I see 30? Dave Richardson said 25. Alex was 25. first, though. Oh, Alex? Yep. Alex for 25. Can I see 30? David. 30 to Dave. 30 to Dave. 30, 30 to Dave. Can I see 35? Can I see 35? We're sitting on 30. Can I see 35? We're sitting on 30. 30, 30, 30, 30. Looking let for Dave 35. And, let Dave and Robert battle it out. And let's go on to the next one. So this was lot 45 for the ICAs. Remember, Pat, you won lot 44. Uh, lot number 46. Is I have, this real? <laughs> I have Fast Mafia. I have five 3,700 boxes and one 3,700 deep. $35 is the starting bid. Dave came back at 35. We'll let Robert see if he wants it. Um, lot 46 right here. I have five 3700s. Now these are used, okay? So there they are. They got labels on them. They're a little, a little dirty, right? So we got one, two, three. We got five of those. And then we got one deep with a few dividers in there for you to store your little crankbaits, guys. Oh, I'm asking is 35 bucks for this box. Come on, let's go. Lot number. You're already at 40. Scallop Man's got it at 40. 
40, 40, 40, can I see 45? Use boxes. They got a little rash. Put in your baits and catch some bass. We're sitting on 40. We're looking for 45. We got to give Dave. Dave gets that for 35. The fat Icas, that was lot number 45, Dave. We're going to call that. <clears throat> 45 for the boxes. To 45, do I see 50? 45, do I see 250? I see 245, so let's get it to 50. 45, 45, 45, 50, 45, 50, 45, 50. Somebody bring it to 50 because we're sitting at 45. 45, 50, 45, 50, 45, 50. Jay Falaka, you got it at 45. There we go to 50. Alex came back with a 50. <clears throat> All them boxes for half of a hunch. Let's see if we can get to 55. All right, let, let, it, let it kind of – we'll see what happens there. Lot 46, what do we got here? Oh, here's another reel coming up. All right, guys, I have uh, – let's give Alex those boxes for 50 bucks, okay? That's a fair price. All right. Uh, I'll try to get these things shipped out, guys, within the next day or two. Lot number 47 is the Akuma STR3000A. <laughs> brand new in the box, $75. I like that, JP. That's great. What's wrong? Nothing. Okay. Hang in there, bud. Oh, shit. Look at this. It's even got a, a hell of a fancy case. Never even looked at this thing. Uh, Alex, the boxes were lot 46. His rent due. There it is. That's a that's a cool little spinning reel there. Wow. Yeah. 75 bucks. This is lot number 47. Akuma STR 3000A. What a handy little reel, JP. Do you want me to start being the auctioneer? You just kind of... Guys, what we got here is we got a nice Akuma spinning reel. Not only does it come in a box, but it comes bag. He didn't even ever open it. He didn't even know what he had. He's looking for 75. Can I get 75 on the spinning reel? From Akuma. Okuma products. Scott Martin approved. We got the Okuma STR 3000A. Looking for 75. 75, 75, 75, 75. Comes with the travel pack. Little black bag to put it in when you're done fishing. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, goodness. Come on. Somebody wants the Akuma. <clears throat> I met you before at Champlain. My name's not Pete. This is my troll account. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Okay. Uh, the Akuma will let it sit. Okay, next up, lot number 48. I have a scale, a fish scale to weigh your big bass. It's called the Connect Scale. And it's uh, starting bid, 25 bucks. This is the Connect Scale. It Bluetooth, it logs into your phone. It's never been used. 25 lousy dollars for this thing. It's an amazing product. Look at that battery powered scale even comes with a fish lip clip. He's looking for 25 brand new. They go not that particular scale guys, but guys are paying up to a hundred dollars for us nowadays. This one, you got to put two double a batteries in and you're good to go. 25 for the scale and he'll even throw in the bag. 25, 25, 25, 25 for the scale. Not 15. Who, who low balls a scale at 15? Bring it up uh, to 25. R RML. Give me an offer on that Akuma. There we go. Carl oh, says 25. Uh, that's what we asked. Carl bought some stuff. Let's give it to him. All right. Sorry, Bob. Carl got her. All right. Next up, lot 49. Get Bit Baits tube. Two and a half dark melon. 20 packs. $40. There they are. Dark melon. Those are the smaller tubes. We had one of these lots earlier tonight. <coughs> There's 20 packs in here, $40. Ken is the... Oh, we got 40. 
40 for the tubes. These 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 were a hot item earlier in the night, guys. Let's get up to 50. We got 40. Can I see 50? Get bit tubes. There we go. We got 50. Can I see 60? 50. Can I see 60? They get bit tubes. These tubes last. $50 at 60. 60 to mo money. 60. Let me see 60. Mo money. Finally, mo money back in the house. Can we go from 60 all the way to 80, or do you want to meet me in the middle with a 70? 60, 60, 60, 60, not 60. 60 to 70, 70 to 80, sitting on 60. These tubes catch the bass straight all out right, of that. Let's, let's, let's let $60 simmer for a little bit and move on. Next up, lot number 50 is 62. going to be a mojo. What do we got? 65. 65. All right. Next up is lot number 50. <laughs> we have a mojo. 610 medium light extra fast, which must be this one right here. This is uh, going to be a great drop shot rod or Ned Rig rod. 610 medium light extra fast. We're starting that out at $100 for that. Robert, there was 34 DD22. 35 DD22 is in lot two, just so you know. All right, those tubes are going for 65 to Ken. All right, we like Ken. Let's give it to him. I'm glad he got something here. All right. All right, how about that Mojo Bass 610 medium light extra fast? Justin says he'll give you 100. We're going to get a little more for that, so let's let that uh, simmer for a little bit, and we're going to bring up lot 51, JP. How exciting. Ooh, the Under Armour Large and Mercury Beanie. It's All right. Weird. So as we uh, as we work through lot 50, which is the Mojo Bass 610, we're going to look at this one. This is a large, size large, never worn, Under Armour performance shirt, and I have a Mercury beanie, and I'm literally asking 25 bucks for this, guy. This thing's cool. Come on. You'd wear that, JP, if it could fit you, right? Yeah, it wouldn't fit me, though. I know. Yeah. $25, guys. I'm not asking for much. We got a long sleeve Under Armour shirt. It Five whisks, large. It whisks the sweat away while you're catching bass all day. And then when that cool north breeze hits you in the face, you got a red beanie to keep your head warm. That's right. Come on. 120 for the rod, Justin Jr. Never been worn. You guys are funny. We got 120 on the Mojo Rod, no takers on the Under Armour shirt. The freaking right, well, Under Armour have... shirt was probably a hundred bucks. Oh yeah, yeah, my sister bought it for Christmas. It didn't fit. 25 the shirt you got. All right, Bass and Burger. Let's see if anyone else wants it, but that's a heck of a deal. 25 bucks for this. It's, the rod went to Justin Jr. for 120. All right, hold on. So who got the T-shirt? So lot 51 was the Under Armour and the Beanie for 25, and that went to Bass and Burger. Bass and Burger for 25. Okay, and then that 610 Mojo Rod, brand new. Justin Jr. for 120. For 120. That's a good deal, Justin. You did good there. All right, that was lot 50. Oh, here's a fun little lot coming up. We're super. Lot number 52, guys, is a big-ass bag of Kitech football jigs. 25 of them, miscellaneous sizes from a quarter, three-eighths, and a half ounce, $50. There's 25 Kitech football jigs in here, and we're doing 50 bucks. There's different colors, green pumpkin, black and blue. There they all are, all in good shape, some Oops. quarter. Samada says he'll give you 25. <laughs> well, it's 50 bucks for him. <laughs> Lot number 52. There's there's uh how many jigs are in here? 25 Kai Tech football head jigs in here. Okay, so we got 55 from Tommy Ruin. 55 will give for 60. It's the Kai Tech, it's the football jig, it's the original micro football jig. It's got Paul a tungsten, yep. Tungsten head. And a, and a smaller hook. It is no the Kitech Kitech 
football jig and there's 25 of them and right now we're at 60 60 to 70 let's see 70 let's see 70 sitting at 60 looking for 70 sitting at 60 looking for 70 sitting at 60 looking for 70 eric quit 60 <laughs> 60. all right keep looking guys so so eric was on earlier he had some family obligations he sold um some some pretty cool crank baits and swim baits and some weird shit. 65, um, 65, 65, 65, 65. I mean, what are these? Five bucks a piece? So yeah, 25 times five is what? What's 25 times five, bud? Help me out. What's that? 25 times five is uh 125. We got 70, 70 looking for 75, 70 looking for 75, 70 looking for 75, sitting on 70, 25 Kitech football jigs micro jigs there's 25 of them and we're sitting on 70 can we see 75 okay let's uh let's let that marinate a little bit and we'll get into lot 53 if you want to introduce lot 53 and we'll okay. see where lot 52 settles so far lot 52 is todd remember <clears> guys <throat> if you win a lot i need you to go to paypal or my Venmo, and make sure in the description of those you write your full name and your shipping address as well as what lot you won. And if you feel like it, please send me an email with that information as well. Uh, okay, these do guys. have a weed guard in it, yes. Okay, guys, lot number 53 is going to be 14 Mega Bass boxes, the 3700 series, for $60. All right, let's call the uh, the Kitex here. Todd for 70 70 bucks, Todd. Lot 52. JP, I want to take a moment to thank you tonight. Um, no problem. I do appreciate this. Oh, man. Lot number 53. We have, what do we have here? 14 Monster Bass 3700 boxes. What are we starting that out at? 60 bucks. This is a great deal you got right here, deal. fellas. So if you're you looking at tax organization, getting ready for the, the season, we literally have 14 of these boxes here, the 3700 style for $60. It's going to cost me 40 to ship this thing. The Jordan flu game. I'm falling through my ass, guys. So we got 14 boxes, 3700 series, brand new for 60 I got 65. Carl, we got 65. Can I see 70? I'm really losing my voice. <clears throat> we got the 65. Can I see 70? 65 looking for 70. 65 looking for 70. 70, 70, 70 looking for 65. We got 65 from the main who gets. Whoa, Danny comes in at 70. 70. All right, 70. let's let that go. And I'm going to grab another interesting deal that I want to see if. Uh... Ooh, Carl, it's 78. Okay, this is lot number 54. Uh, this is by Amped Marine. It's a tackle storage system that hangs on the wall. Basically, it holds your, here's a tray right here. You take your 3,700 trays, you put this on your wall, and you stick them in there. Um, I think it retails over 100 bucks for this thing. It's definitely not worth $100. Um, I was going to do 40 bucks because it's going to cost a little bit to ship it. You can see right here, uh, the screws go in there and here, and you can hang it this way or this way, whatever way you want. It's just a nice little tackle storage system for 40 bucks, guys. Uh, where are we at with those boxes? Uh, $80, Steve Hardy. Steve Hardy. 80 we like Steve. Let's give it to – well, we like Carl too, but – Carl only did 78. Carl, I got I got a feeling we'll have more of these coming up. Um, let's give Steve those. 83 to Carl. <laughs> oh, shit. 83, Carl. Carl's been buying a lot of stuff, though, man. I know, but we like Steve as well. Well, then give it to Steve. I'm not going to. I guess it's whoever. Let's give him a second. Tom, 40 bucks for the amp organizer. You'll have to pick it up, but if you want, you can. I'll ship it out. We'll give it to Tom. We got to get Tom some more goodies here. I think that's his first thing he got this. Where are we 
gap between Steve and Carl? They both went silent. Carl, do you want to do? Oh, wait a minute. We got 85. There we go. Captain Nostris for 85. Well, hold on. We got to let these guys come back. <clears throat> come on, JP. All right. Where are we at with the uh, boxes? Actually, the boxes. Some guy just said 14 new boxes for 90. I don't know. You work it out, bud. Okay, here's the deal, guys. You got 10 seconds to make your last purchase price on the 14 boxes. Right now it's at 90. Can I see 95? It's at 90. Can I see 95? Going once. Going twice. Carl, I feel bad, but the guy said 90. Sold for $90. All right, 90 bucks. Who was that? Rogue Trader. Oh, yeah, we like him. All right. Okay, guys, lot number 55 is a Corrado. This is a 7 to 4. No boat rash. <laughs> pretty much brand new. I wanted 150 for these Corrados. Let me know. I'm going to keep going. That's a right handed Corrado K 7.4, 150. Lot 55. All right, lot 56 is miscellaneous storage boxes. What the hell could that be? Probably just that. So we have a box full of miscellaneous storage stuff. I have it starting out at 35 bucks. I'll go through it. We have a Spro double compartment. I got uh, just another plastic box. I got another plastic box. Like, I don't even know if you guys want this stuff. Bass Mafia, a little rust in the back. Don't worry about that. Just clean it off. A line thing. This. This. And then a Gamagatsu foam. Like a hook. Whatever that is. What do I want for this? 35 bucks for the whole stupid box. It's going to cost me 15 to ship it. There you go. Jay Flocka, 35. 35 for the miscellaneous boxes. Sean, do you want to go to 40? We got 35. Four. Oh, we got 40. Ken came in with 40. Can we see 45? Ken came in with 40. Can we see 45? Anything on that Corrado? Jay Flocka says 45. We got 45. Can we see 50? I'm not going to auction off the boat. I see 40 from Mike. I see 45 from Jay Falaka. All right. I'm going to keep I'm going to keep going here. Um, we'll, we'll, let's figure that mess out, JP, okay? Two St. Mm -hmm. shirts and All right. That was lot number 56 was the miscellaneous storage boxes. Where are we at there? Grat 84 says he'll give you 64K for the boat. No. Um, it was uh, 45 to Falaka, sold. All right. Who is it? Falaka? Yeah, Jay. Captain, Captain right? No, just oh. Jay Falaka. F L O C K A. Okay. You got that? That's lot 56. All right, lot 57. I have a Mercury beanie and two St. Croix t-shirts, size large, never worn. They're pretty cool shirts. St. Croix, best rods on earth. A little wrinkled. Um, I got, what do I have for that price? 30 bucks. No, not 30. Uh, 25 bucks for the two St. Croix t-shirts, size large. And then the Mercury beanie. 25 lousy bucks for this. Come on, guys. Size large. Lot 57. Lot 57. Got a beanie and a couple shirts, guys. It's a pretty good deal. 25 bucks for two shirts and a beanie. Who wants it? I'm going to keep going. <laughs> God dang, JP. Oh, it's bad. Lot 58. Okay, Mo Money says lot 57. He wants that for 25 Mo Money, let me know. Confirm in the comments if you want that. 
Lot 58, get bit baits two. Two and a half, 15 pack, 30 bucks. And this would be the, oh, the leech color. So this is a uh, Get Bit Baits tubes, 15 packs, $30. And this is the leech color, another great color. What's the 35 for, Ken? The beanie and the shirts or the leech? Because right now I got Dale Lotch at 25 for the, Lock okay, there we go, 30. 30, let's give it to uh, Dale. Dale, Dale, you got lot 57. Lot 58, and we're almost getting done, guys. Get bit baits, tubes, two and a half. Oh, okay. Where are we at here? Slump 40. Slump to lump says he'll give you a 40. JP, sell me. <laughs> yeah, Ryan <laughs> Ivers, that's my man. He wants me to sell him. <laughs> 42 for the leech, 42 for the leech. Let me get 52. Come on, guys. It's that special tube. We got 40 bucks. <laughs> yeah, 42 by Ken. Um, no, guys, I didn't give up on get bit baits. I literally have 500 pounds of tubes in my garage. Where are we at with these tubes? 42? $42 to Ken. I don't think JP's behind. JP, tell me the next comment you see. Jablowski. Yep. We're not behind at all, guys. Slump Gump. 45 to Slumpy Gump. Uh, leech, Sean, they're Leech. Let's let that marinate a little bit, and let's go to lot 59, which is... Oh. 47 to Ken. All right, let's let that marinate. That's the leech color. All right, now I have lot 59 is miscellaneous grubs. These are hypertail grubs, 25 bucks for all of them. There they are, huge ass bag of the hypertail grubs, little smaller bag of that melon copper. And then we have a silver, black with silver flake. I just, I got, you know, two bags of these hypertails. They work great on the back of swim jigs, things like that or just casting um, 25 bucks for all those grubs. Let's right. call the uh, get bait bait, bud. Yeah, Ken got that for 47. Okay. Got a good deal there, Ken. All right, miscellaneous grubs. Haven't seen a miscellaneous bid. Somebody says, hold one up. All right, we will, sorry. They're probably four inch. It's the hyper tails. I throw those all the time. See, it's got that little. No, you can't really see it, but there you go. We're hyper not ignoring tail. the fact that the guy offered 130. Travis blatantly said he's not selling the reels for $130. I'd like to get 150 for those Corrados. Sorry, Sean. You show up late, you lose to uh, to the H2O man. All right, what we got on the grubs, guys? 25. Get, let's give it a little bit. And let's go to lot 60. I have five packs of flap, flapping hogs for $15. We got some good stuff coming up, JP. All right. Flapping hogs, black and blue. Okay, they're all black and blue. One, two, three, four, five packs. And we wanted $20, $15 for five right now. Okay, you got 15. Let's go back and just sell those grubs. All right. Five. Let's, who's got Small the grubs? Smallmouth junkie. What's that, bud? Smallmouth junkie. Smallmouth Junkie has the grubs, okay? You got that, Smallmouth Junkie? <clears throat> MJ's got 20 on the hogs. 
Lot got six, 20 on the hogs, and they see 25. Flapping hogs are a great trailer for the back of a jig if you're looking for a big profile for a largemouth. 20, 20, 20. Can we get 25? <laughs> Jeez, JP. Hang in there, bud. We got 22 for the hogs from the scallop assassin. Back, back away from this camera here. I don't it was better further away. Okay. 25 to MJ. If nobody, <laughs> let's see how we do with that. All right, guys. Oh, this is the this is the part you guys have been waiting for. The lot you've been waiting for. I got lot 61. I got five flatworms in the 4.25 size. Twenty dollars. Let's MJ, call you got it for twenty-five. The flapping hogs. Yep. MJ. Okay. Let me grab my flatworms. Okay. Wait a minute. What color are those? Yep. These are the natural shad. <coughs> I got one. Two, three, four, five packs, natural shad, $20. That is lot number 61. That's a $45 value for $20, guys. That's a pretty good bill. All right, we got 20. Can I see 25? These are the flatworms that used to be non-existent. 25, right. we got 25. Can I see 30? Natural shad, 4.25, the larger size, which I prefer. We got a 25. Can I see 25? Can I see 30? We got Mike for 25. Can I see 30? Mike's got 25. <clears throat> 27 to Rogue Trader. 27 can i see 30 27 can i see 30 all right let's let that marinate and let's move on to lot 62 i got nine packs of the general four inch and we're starting bid out at 25 bucks uh actually they're probably double packs so there's a four inch black and blue black and blue black and blue okay all black and blue so we have uh we have Nine packs plus for twenty-five dollars. Um, little general four-inch black and blue. You want to call that flatworm lot? Lot sixty-one, JP. Sixty-one. The flatworms was twenty-eight dollars to Mike. That's a good deal. Mike got a good deal there. All right. How about these little generals? You got thirty dollars on the generals. Were those little generals or generals? Four inch, the generals, I'm sorry. The general, let's not get it mistaken, fellas. This is yep. the general. That's right, JP, that's why we that's why we save some of these auction items and just give them to you for free. That's right. That's right. Yep, whatever you want. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, can I go to the bathroom though, bro, real quick and entertain guests for 30 seconds? Go ahead. All right, All right guys, you. listen up. There's nothing better than helping out your friend and getting treated like what he's about, about to do. Shit. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, we're sitting on the four-pack of Generals. we got $30 on it. They're, they're $8.99 a pack, I think, fellas. And he's got nine packs of them. I mean, eight times eight is 64. So it's a pretty good deal. I'm, I'm saying 30. We should probably get about $40 on that. So we're sitting on 30. Let's get up to 40. Who's coming up to Lake Ontario to fish with Big JP this summer? Let's get that going. Let's let's auction off a guide trip. Somebody throw out a price that a starting price for a guide trip, a realistic one that would make us both happy. Let's see that going there. We got 35 on the generals from MJ. 35 looking for 40. 35 looking for 40. Looking for a starting price for a trip. Let's talk about raffling off a trip here or uh, uh, auctioning off a trip. A realistic starting price. 35 on the generals to MJ. Can I get 40? <clears throat> no comments. Sitting dead here. 
35 <coughs> for the for the generals to MJ. Steve, yes, I do. 300 would probably be low on a starting auction price. 400's getting there. All right, MJ, you got him for 35. All right, what we got? A little, uh, the general? Yeah, 35 to MJ. All right, MJ's on a roll tonight. Okay. Well, I have lot 60. So that was lot 62, MJ. Lot 63 is a big bag of miscellaneous gajos. Here they are. Um, $50. Big, big JPBass.com, fellas. Big JPBass.com. $50, guys. This is literally, uh, well, there's, there's also some X zones in here. So. This is a hell of a deal. 50 bucks for Jesus. I don't even know if we should be doing this. Look at them all, guys. Um, like, there's more. 50 bucks for all those. That's a heck of a deal there. <coughs> Wouldn't you say, JP? The beautiful deal of God just beats. Yeah, there is some blue highlight in there. There you go. 50 bucks for that big bag. Miscellaneous. Oh, you colors. got 60 for the Gajos, bud. Most Ryan Ivers says he'll do 60. 60, 60. Can I see 65? Dustin Taylor for 65. 65, can I see 70? 65, can I see 70? 65, can I see 70? On the giant bag of Gajo baits mixed in with the X Zone competitor. We got 65. Love to see 70. Let's go. Steve, it was a rough start, but we're pulling through. We got 83 to Gloria Pushafave. Is that real? Uh, <laughs> Gloria Pushafate? Uh We're going to have to take a vote here, Gloria. Grant 85 is at $500 for a guide trip with JP. I got 500. Can I see 600? I got 500. Can I see 600? Now we're being realistic and it turned into a real deal. Grant 85, Grant 84 has got it at 500. Let's see what we can get it up to, fellas. Guys, where are we at with these, please? Uh, I don't think that other one's real. So you're at 65, Dustin Taylor. Okay, good. Gloria, not that we don't believe you. I'm at 500. Let's see. I've just never seen your name before. I mean, you're a beautiful girl. <laughs> <laughs> My uterus smells like queechy. What? <laughs> Ryan Ivers for 68. Ryan Ivers for 68. Oh um. <laughs> All right, let's wrap this up. All right, Ryan Ivers gets the Gajos for 68. Really? That's a hell of a deal. Grant 84, we still got the guide trip at 500. Are you serious, Grant? 68. Who won that lot for uh, 68? Ryan Ivers. Brian? Ryan. Ryan. Ryan, you won the miscellaneous bag of Gajos, lot 63. All right, lot 64, guys. We're almost done. Z-Man long shots, eight pack. So we have an eight pack of the Z-Man long shots. We're starting out at 20 bucks. Just, uh, it looks like Mood Ring and Twilight and Green Pumpkins. Never used. 20 bucks, eight pack for the Z-Man long shots. <laughs> These comments are funny. They say we're behind, so we have to wait a little bit, JP, I think. 
twenty dollars. Sean says he'll give you for them. So did Carl. Well, it's between Sean and Carl, both yeah. great guys. How do we choose? We got to. One of them's got to go to twenty-two. Right? Well, Carl just did. Look at that, twenty-two for Carl. Twenty-two for Carl. So let's get up to twenty-five for Sean. Twenty-two for Carl. Carl's spending a lot of money yeah. today. Carl, Carl, Carl. The long <laughs> shot right. is selling these demand baits. Dan. 25, 25 to Dan, 25, 25, can I see 30? Come on, Carl, bust it up to 30. 25, 25, 25 for the long shot. 25 for the long shot, looking for 30. Can I get 30? Can I get 30? Sitting on 25. Okay, <laughs> so let's do 25 to for Dan. Dan, what's his name? Magner. He won a, a few times, I think, tonight. Yeah. Okay. Gloria, 2575. Gloria, sorry, bud. Carl, you missed out again, dude. I'm starting to feel bad for Carl. <laughs> All right. Z Man. Carl's lot, doing that shit on purpose. Lot number 65. Z Man, nine packs of TRDs. And we'll go through it. Uh, 20 bucks. 20 bucks. Nine packs. Looks like some of them are doubled up. Uh, we got Twilight. This definitely doubled up Twilight. Black and blue, black and blue, black and blue, black and blue, black and tripled up black and blue. A lot of black and blues and twilights. Some great colors. Uh 20 bucks. Lot 65, guys. Lot 65. We can't be too far behind because I just sent the comment in and I instantly saw it. Yeah. Okay, so we're at 20 on the Z-Man 9 pack. <laughs> I love these comments tonight. Now we're at 25. 25, now we're at 30. Waves current ice has got it at 30. Let's bring it back to the USA. We don't want any product shipping over to Canada. I'm only 25 minutes from the border, yet <laughs> it's going to cost me 40 bucks to ship that bag that costs 30 bucks that you win. So, But Waves current and ice, we do appreciate you trying. If he's at 30, can we get 35? Mm. Heck, Muscle Milk Mike. Muscle Milk Mike's on the line, and he says we're 13 seconds behind. I wonder if that's who Jablowski is. It could be. Hmm, interesting. All right, where are we at? <clears throat> we got to move on. We're almost, we're so close to being done. So Waves Kern and Ice was at 30, but now it says he'll go 31. 31, 31, 31. Now we got 40. Scott's at 40. Sold to Scott for 40. All right, Scott, you won lot number 65 for $40. Oh, wow. Here's a great, great lot. Lot number 66 is going to be, I don't even know. Let me look at it here. Lot 66. Oh, shit. My chair broke, bro. Oh, no. Just the wheel fell off. We're good. That's I didn't put that together, before. did I? Ooh. Yeah, this ain't good, bud. Son of a bitch. I really like this chair. Now I'm lopsided. Just what I wanted to deal with. Okay, guys. Lot number 66. We have Cortland Line. We have 300 yards. 300 yards of eight pound black. We have 300 yards. There might be some missing here in this one, but it's still pretty full of eight pound. Oh, I'm sorry, moss green. Both of them are moss green. And then I have a big ass spool, 1500 yards of five pound green. And I might have used a little bit, but there's still a ton on here. I'm just going to say 50 bucks for lot 66. We're going on the oh, fishing yeah. line, guys. We're trying to start out at $50. $50 for all that braid. My chair. 
might have to sell this chair tonight. Oh, it's wrecked, bro. Does anyone want that line, JP? Yeah, we're at 60. Now we're at 80. Lot 66. <laughs> Hold on a minute, Travis. We're getting a little ahead of ourselves. Dan's got the line at 80. So can we get to 85? He started at 50. Now we're at 80. Can we get to 85? Can't wait to ship all this out. Whew. Okay. Let's continue on. So I have lot 67, which is a, a pretty good condition. Brand new almost. Bass Mafia line bag. I'm just going to do 15 bucks, guys. Let's start out at $15 for that line bag from Bass Mafia. It's, it's brand, I mean, I've tried it before. I guess I just, it's pretty good. It's real good condition. Danny, you um, won the line for 80. 80 bucks on the line. Okay, who won that? Uh, Danny Rosenwinkel. Danny Rosenwinkel. All right. How about that Bass Mafia line bag, lot number 67? Grant says he'll give you a 15. Um, that's what we're asking. So let's see if somebody. Uh... 15, 15, look it for 20. It's a bag that holds your line and keeps it straight in dimes. That's right. Bass Mafia, baby. Put well, how does it how many how many how many uh rolls of line know. does it hold? It's a bunch. They can look it up. Oh, okay. Now you sound like <laughs> the guy at the bass club the other day. Oh, I'm handing out all this stuff I'm sponsored from. I had a question and he goes, I don't know. You'd have to read. I don't know anything about it. So you're handing out stuff you don't even know. 16 bucks to Anthony 777. One dollar up. All right. Anthony, you got it. All right. Oh shit. Anthony, you got it because Grat Grat came in, but we called it already. I'm sorry. Um, the lot number for the braid, Danny, was lot number 66. All right, guys, we're almost done. Lot 68 is, ooh, we got some good stuff coming up. We got some good stuff coming up, JP. Guys, it's not that we're that we suck at our jobs here. It's because the comments come in and we, we can see pretty much in real time. But when we call it and then we look down, all of a sudden, I know I'm pissing some people off. I'm sorry. Oh, man. Okay. So lot number... Uh, what was it? 68 is a gorilla gripper. Um, we're starting this out at $20. So this is like, if you have a big carp that you catch, you can take this and, uh, you put, put it in its lips and grab onto that thing. And then I think it even has a, I guess it doesn't it's have like a, a salt water scale. Yeah. It's a gorilla gripper guys. This is a really nice gripper. And it's only $20 here in the Smallmouth Crush Live auction tonight. And this is lot number 68. Will someone just buy this so I don't have to keep putting this in the, my plastic bin and bring it out every auction? Because this is the one item that never gets sold, JP. Oh, look at that. She says he'll take it for 20 Who does? Sean. Sean what, what are you going to do with a Gorilla Gripper, Sean? You live in Chicago. <laughs> I love that comment from Jason. <clears throat> All right, Sean, you want the Gorilla Gripper for 20 bucks? It's yours. Can we call it? JP, with me? Yeah, 20 bucks to Sean. All right. So Sean's going to carry this four pound Gorilla Gripper around in his backpack for the occasional muskie that he catches. Okay. Darius King. Um, all right. Lot number 69 is six Monster Bass 3,700 boxes. 
for thirty dollars. So here's six of these thirty-seven hundreds for thirty bucks. Don't ever lip a musky, Sean. <laughs> yeah, didn't you do that once? Uh, I've dumbass in Wisconsin, you had all the band aids on, your hand was all ripped off. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. All right, Grat, you're the highest bidder so far, Captain. Oh, 30 to 35, 35 to 40, 40, 40, 40. Boxes like to sell 40. Let me see 50, 40. Let me see 50, 40. Let me see 50, 40. Keep that let me going, see 50. and I'm going to grab lot 70. We have a box of miscellaneous crankbaits. And I'm starting this off at $50. And I'll go through some of them. I'm just going to hold some stuff up. This is $50 for these. We got some old Normans in here. Bandits, I guess they are. Uh, 50 bucks for all these. Like, like, I don't know what's all in here. I'm going to try to show the camera the best I can. I see a Bagley's we in there. We got 50 on the boxes. 50. Let me see 60. 50. Let me see 60. Carl's getting pissed. 50. Now I got 55. 55. Let me see 60. 50 55. Let me see 60. miscellaneous crankbaits, guys. Oh, right. I see a Rapala. Right before there. spending some money. 55 on the boxes. 55 on the boxes. 55. Let me see 60. 55. Let me see 60. 55 going once. 55 going twice. Right now, I'm going to say that it's Pen 55 for the 10 seconds for the delay to grant. All right, where are we at with those boxes? There's Captain Nostris with 60. Guys, you see these miscellaneous crankbaits, lot 70, right? $50. 55 right. in the boxes to grab. Can we get it to Carl, please? Okay. All right, sorry, Grant. It's going to Carl for 62. Carl, you got this, man. We owe you. Still waiting on my scallops. Yeah. Hey, hey, Carl, are you going to the New England Fishing Expo? Please put it in the comments. Lot 70 miscellaneous crankbaits. Sorry, Captain. <laughs> Captain's pissed. No, he's he did a laughing or the cry. Maybe he is pissed. <laughs> WTF? You know what he's going to do to me? He's going to Dave Mansue me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Lot 69 was the Monster Bass 3,700 boxes that Carl won. We have Lot 70, which is miscellaneous crankbaits for 50 bucks. I saw a bid. Dustin is going to do 50 on these cranks, but I'm telling you, there's a lot more than $50 worth of crankbaits in here. Somebody needs to step up here, please. All right, so look at this one right here. This is a Bagley's custom painted one by TK Stanley. This one right here. Come on, guys. So I got 55 on the cranks from Captain Nostrand. 55, can I see 60? 55, can I see 60? Got 56. Shit, look at this one. There's another Bagley's in there. Okay, now we got 60. 60, can I see 65? Oh, that one. 60, can I see 65? 60, can I see 65? 61. Jesus this Christ. This is a $150 bag right here. <laughs> 65. 65, can I see 70? 66. <laughs> the, captain, the captain's not going out without a fight. I am, 66. I am Sean, going to the classic. 66 can i see 70 now i got 70 70 70 70 can i see 70 there he comes back with 71 the captain's fired up 75 75 can i see 76 75 can i see 76 there's the 70 76 can i see 80 this is pretty good 76 can i see 80 the cream baits that marinate there's the 80 come captain back with the 81 Come on, Captain, back with the 81. I'm at 80. Can I see 81? I'm at 80. Can I see 81? All right, let it <laughs> chill. Let's go to lot. <laughs> Jeez, JP. Lot 70 was the miscellaneous crankbaits. 
Lot 71 is going to be miscellaneous plastics. Let me grab that. Here it is. We're starting lot 71 out at $50 as well. Okay, Darius gets the crankbaits for 80. Yes. Okay, so who won the crankbaits for 80? Darius? Uh, Darius, yeah. Okay. All right, we got three left, fellas. Let's get through these three. Miscellaneous plastics, lot 71, $50. I'll go through it. We got some big-ass true bass swim baits in there. Uh, some get bit bait tubes, some... Beast Coast swim baits. Here, what I'm going to do is just let me. Okay, so we got some swim baits. JP, you paying attention? Yep. I'm going to just hold them up as I put them in. Some Z Man stuff. Bag of original Senkos. Uh, a bunch of ticklers. Uh, power tubes, nice big bag of power tubes. We got a bunch of yum, yum dingers. Okay, uh, we got 70. We got 70 on the plastics. We got 70 on the plastics. Of, uh, a whole bunch of tubes, get bit bait tubes. We got uh, some more hula sticks. We got some Beast Coast stuff. We got some more Beast Coast stuff. Tubes. Oh, uh, pretty nice assortment of jigs in here. No clue. Some more four inch Senkos originals. Nice little pack of those. I got some big TRDs. So, yeah, where are we at with that? No, nowhere. I, I thought I saw a guy with 70, but then he told okay. me no. All right. So, no one's interested in your big box of plastics. Well, someone's going to be. Oh, there we go. We got 50 bucks from Warren County Bass. 50, 50, 50. Can I get 55? 55, 55. I got 50. Can I see 50? Wave current and ice comes in at 60. He's dying to get something. No, tonight. He's there at 60. Canada. 60. Can I get 61? Where's the captain? Get wave current and ice back on his side of the river. We got 60. Can I see 65? Can I see 65? Waves current and ice will probably be at the New England Fishing Expo. He'll come down. There you go. 60, 60, 60. Can I see 65? Can I see 65? Can I see 65? Sit nuts, D. 70 to Pin Hook Fish Club. Thank you very much. We got 70. Can I see 75? <laughs> okay. We got 70. Can I see 75? We're just bidding on a, a bulk, a bulk thing of of uh of tackle. Like the big bag of tackle. All right, let's call it. Who's got it? 70 to Pinhook Fish Club. All right, Pinhook, you got it. Lot 72, I have 19 Monster Bass 3,700 boxes starting out at $90. Okay, here you go, Carl. Here's your boxes, man. We have the we Mega have Bass 19. 3700. There's 19 boxes, Carl. $90. Some of them, some of them have been used slightly in here, but they're very, very clean. Okay. Uh, and most of them, most of them still have the packages on. That was maybe two or three that are out of the package, out of the 19. Boxes for ninety dollars. <throat> Who's in? Come on, guys! You guys were all about the boxes earlier. Who doesn't want to buy a box? Here we go, Danny Rosenwinkel for ninety. We got ninety. Can I see ninety-five? We got ninety. How can I see ninety-five? Carl, let's go, guys. Six, Carl, just so you know. We got a hundred. We got a hundred. Can I see a hundred and ten? We got a hundred. Can I see a hundred and ten? 
We got 100. Can I see 110? Oh, that's Muscle Milk Mike with 100. Nice job, Mike. 105, 105 up to 110. We're at 110. Can I get to 115? We're at 110. Can I get to 115? Todd was the first guy to 110. Todd was the first guy to 110. We're at 110. Can I get to 115? 115. We got 115. Mike Zambines goes to 120. Muscle Milk Mike for 120. We got 120. Can I see 125? We got 120. Can I see 125? Mike from New Jersey with the 120. Let's see if we can get 125. Boxes like to sell, bro. 120. Yeah. Let's get to 125. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> Ooh, you're making me at 135. Sick. We're at 135. Can we get to 140? We're at 135. Can we get to 140? We're All at right. the end. 140 uh, to Mike's Mike Zambines. Mike really wants them boxes. Mike wants them boxes. He put it at 140. All 140, right. 140, 140. As we as we figure this out, guys, I simply have two lovely red mercury beanies, $15. Lot 73. Two beanies, 15 bucks. Lot 73. 140, Mike went to, so then Carl comes back at 141. One forty-five, one forty-four. Now we're at one forty-five. We're at one forty-five, one forty-five. Let me get the one fifty. One forty-five, looking for one fifty. One forty-five, looking for one fifty. One forty-five, looking for one fifty. One fifty-one, one fifty-one. All right, guys, let's jump up a little bit more instead of dollar increments because JP's feeling sick and we're sick of waiting on these boxes. Um, it's a one fifty-one for, for, for sixteen bucks. You got that? <laughs> All right, on the boxes, I'm going one. I'm going the the 13 second wait. Mike's got it at 151. 151 once. All right, they want us to bid it out, bud. What do you mean? Just let them. Let's just see what happens here. Okay. All right, lot 74. This is a special one. I I didn't want to sell this because uh, it's a special edition. Never worn super hoodie by Mercury, and uh, it's starting out. It's an extra large. We're starting to bid out at a hundred dollars for this. You will not find this anywhere but here on Smallmouth Crush Live. This thing is extra warm and extra green. Okay, so here you go. What size is that? It's an XL, bud. Oh, thanks, bud. Yep, and then uh, the back. Thanks, bud. This is a limited edition. You're never, ever going to find this Mercury. Look at that thing. I would wear that thing every day. You would wear this green thing? Hell yeah, I would. Muscle Milk Mike, you won the boxes, 151. And that was uh, that was lot 73. Or, I'm sorry, 72 for those boxes. It's an extra large, brand new. It's a hundred bucks, guys, just because I would still got the tag on it. You will never ever find anything like this. Uh, Dustin Taylor, you won the beanies at 18. No, Anthony did. Huh? I called it already. Oh, okay. Take that back. Take that back from Dustin so he don't send 18 bucks in. Sorry, Dustin. It's got to go to Anthony. I don't see Anthony's thing. 16 bucks. Okay. Man, Nobody you get stuff like that. Money. You got to let me know, man. I would wear that. <sighs> that thing's sweet. Look at that thing. Nobody wants it? This is so crazy that nobody wants this. But everybody's saying send the hoodie to JP. JP, you can't fit in an extra large. Take that JP's commission. I don't get no commission. You guys, you know what? You know what the problem is with all you people? You all think you got to get something for every single thing you do. You know, you help out a buddy. You know, it all comes back in the long run. I don't mind coming on here and helping out. I'm falling through my ass, though. I ain't going to lie. Was that the last one? No, we got a little bit more. Oh, my God. Okay. I think I got to give this to you, JP. Nice. <laughs> no. It's nice. 
<laughs> okay. Mm. Uh, all right. Who won the tackle boxes? Muscle Milk Mike, Mike Zambrones. And how much? 151. Okay. You want to sell that box I told you to put in the corner for me? No. All right. You wanted it. All right, guys, we're almost done. I'm just going to throw a couple bonus things out here. Um, wow, we're going at four hours of auctioning. I'm sorry. Would anyone be interested in a 15-pound Richter anchor? These things retail for about 80 bucks. I'd be willing to ship it to you for 50 Listen to this comment. Hey, oh, JP, what? if you run Travis's auction, he will pay it back by letting you net his fish in the next team <laughs> tournament you fish with him. Uh-huh. <laughs> All right, where are we at here, guys? Does anyone want a Richter anchor, 18 pound? <laughs> that, jacket, that jacket matches the color of the shit JP's been hacking up all night. I love it. I know it's going to cost 50 bucks to ship, but... All right, so nobody wants the anchor. I figured that. We always try to raffle off some sort of scarf here on Smallmouth Crush Live, and I'm getting, I'm getting a little low on the scarf. So I'm offering two Mercury beanies. This might be the last scarf you'll ever see on an auction. I have a Mercury scarf and two Mercury beanies. JP, this is a special moment here on the live show. Yep. We're going to call this lot 75, and I'm just going to let you guys bid. There is no starting price. Two beanies and a scarf, lot 75. All right, you got $20 at it so far from Dustin Taylor. And while they're bidding on the two beanies and the scarf, we're going to keep going with a couple more items. All right, I have a Hummingbird Mega 360, uh, very good condition. This is for the Fortrex, and we're going to start the bidding at $800 for this. If that particular in. 360 will also fit a ghost trolling motor. That bracket fits the ghost trolling motor shaft. Yep, and that's $800 for this if anyone's interested. We got $35 so far on the two beanies and the scarf. Yeah, you're at $35 to T-Fish 202. 35. All right, anyone reach out if, if they're interested in this 360. I'm not going to take up much more time. I have the little Kong mount. Uh, this is a three inch base. 40 for the beanies. We're up to 40 for that. That was four treks, Pat. Right, JP? Yeah. Okay. If anyone's interested in the Kong mount, let me know. And then I got one more item. I'm just throwing this out there, guys. So this is a. <laughs> You're not selling that front, bud. He's laughing because he thinks this is the one he, he let me use, but it's not. This is my replacement. So this is a Fury 4-blade, uh, 23 pitch. I'm sorry. A Fury 4-blade, 24 pitch, brand new. I'd like to get 700 for that. It's definitely my prop. It, what's that? It's definitely my prop. It's not your prop. <laughs> And while I got you guys here, I have a Camus butt seat for a Camus. If you guys are interested in this thing, reach out to me. Okay. I'm just trying to move product, JP. Um, and then let's go. Let's just go back to a few things. Let's wrap up that scarf. <laughs> he stole the prop and sells it in front of him. Uh, Scott, the Kong, I could do... Um, 
I'll do 80 bucks on that Kong. The butt seat is 250, fellas. It costs 250 for that thing? Probably costs 500. Yeah. Um, R RML, if you're interested in that butt seat, throw me a price here. Let's be fair. How much is the hoodie you're wearing? This one's not for sale. <laughs> Travis is very possessive over the clothes that he actually does wear, fellas. That's right. Um, okay, Sean, that's not funny. I went a little dark on the fucking beard dye. I'm sorry. It won't happen again. Okay. You actually did dye it? What did you think, bro? What's wrong with you? Just embrace your whiskers of wisdom. What is wrong with you? Get out of here. Pinhook, no duck decoys. Um, okay. What, can we call the beanie and uh, scarf, please? <laughs> Come on. We got a lot to get through. <clears throat> I know. Everybody calls me Shuffield lately. JP, the beanies yeah. and the scarf. Where are we at? It was forty dollars. Forty bucks. Who won it? Uh, hold on. A T Fish two hundred two. Who is he? T Fish two zero two. All right, T Fish, you got that. <clears throat> okay, real quick, let's go back to this Mojo glass rod. This is ridiculous that we can't sell it. This is a 7.2 heavy medium. This is a great cranking rod. This is just like the St. Croix, the, the legend glass rods, except it's the Mojo. I'm just asking for a $100 ship for this, guys, if anyone's interested in this. I forgot what lot number that was. Bear with me, JP. We're almost done. Lot number 27, Mojo Glass, 72HM. 72HM. Does the carpet match the drapes? <laughs> I don't think anyone has gray stuff down under, do they? Dude, I think Jablowski went to bed. I haven't seen him. <laughs> no, he, he is, yeah. <laughs> This is a, a bait casting rod. All right. Let's just take a little bit. Uh, let's go back to those Gajo Spirit Shads, guys. We're going to wrap this up, JP. Just give me a second. Lot 15, 64 green pumpkin purple Gajo Spirit Shads, $100. Oh, there's 64 bags. <laughs> fucking guy. Dollars. Let's start it out. Come on, let's move some stuff. Lot 15. Dude, that's the only one you didn't sell. No, I got a couple. Come on. I'm so confused. Why are they talking about Philly? What's wrong with Philadelphia? What's going on? Oh, uh, there's a football game tonight. So yeah, who gives was... a fuck about football? Who I'm won the game anyway? Football. Did the Bills win? Who cares? Oh, you got ninety dollars. Mo Money says he'll give you ninety. Where are we at? Ninety. Ninety bucks for Mo Money. All right, Mo Money, you got lot fifteen for ninety dollars. Okay, we're almost wrapping this up. I do have to circle back, guys. <clears throat> the lot two, the original lot, we just could not sell these for some reason. Perhaps I have to lower the price. This was 35 DD22s. I was asking 140. I'll do 100 bucks to get this bag out of my life. Mo Money, you won lot number 15. 15 was all those spirit shads. Bass and grass. People have to put the lot numbers with their PayPal. That's the only way I can keep track. 
Mike, no Dobbins. All right, Tom, then, then let's go. 100 bucks. Wait, Rob said he'd give you 100 Rob, you're in Robert for 100 Robert You said 100 and you'd sell him. Robert, they're yours. Okay, Robert, you got it. Lot number two, Robert. Remember that. $100. Robert, we got you down. Okay. <laughs> Remember, nobody wants the reels, these Corrados. I was trying to get 150 I'll do 125 I guess, for them. If anybody's still there, I have a 6 to 2, a 7 to 4. And a six to two, 125 a piece. Seven to four and two six to twos. Let me know, please. And then we're gonna wrap this up, JP. I appreciate you tonight, man. Yeah. 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 And nobody wants this mojo, this glass rod? No, That's somebody said it. that they'd give you a hundred dollars to break it over your knee. Okay, well, I'm not sure. Grant, don't get lippy with me, bud. I, I can't keep up with all the comments. I might have said some words, but I'm willing to negotiate. It's towards the end of the auction. I'm ready to move some product. So, Where are we at, JP? Um, You were trying to – oh, there you go. 75 for the rod, Warren County Bass, New Jersey. Uh, I, Warren, I, Warren, can you do, it's going to cost me 20, 25 to ship. Um, can you do 90 Warren? I can't do 250 for all three Corrados. Uh, <laughs> Warren, Warren said, okay. What did, what did I ask Warren to do on that rod? You asked him for 90. 90? All right, let's do it. Man, waves, current, and ice got boxed out every corner today. We try. The division uh, Warren, is tight. That was, lot, that was lot 27, just so you know. Captain Nostrant said he'll give you 125 for the, one of the 6.2s. Uh, who did? Captain Nostrant. Okay, for which one? The 6.2? Yeah, the 6.2 gear ratio. All right. Carado. All right, Captain, you got it. I'm going to call that lot number 21. Okay. You got lot 21, which is a 6 to 2 for 125. All right, now we're moving some stuff. Grannies, I've never ran to see fun reels, okay? Don't don't listen to these people. Um, slump, my last four digits is 0881. If you guys need to confirm it, 0881. Yes, lot nine prime fishing. Well, JP, you got a nice rare mercury hoodie out today's show you got a box uh, to store your plastics i'd say it's a win-win uh. sean i didn't see your your offer bud come on oh, rude rude come on sean there All he is right, I think too hey the one I guy needs hey the they need the last four digits of your phone number for your Venmo. I, I said that, 0881. Oh, okay. And guys, if again, if you do make a payment, please, please, in the description, whether it be PayPal or Venmo, put the lots you won, put your full name, and put your shipping address down. There's a guy offering you uh, 450 for my prop. <laughs> um, let's see. What lot number was 50-pound braid I won, Danny? Yes, it is a Mega 360. Danny, I have you down for lot 13, which was six 
150 <clears throat> yards of the 50-pound braid. Lot 13, Danny. There you go, Travis. There's a guy giving you 125, 7 to 3 gear ratio. Okay. Dennis, 125. I'll do that for the 7, seven to 4. That's going to be lot number 55. Dennis got lot number 55. You guys got a deal. And then I have one more left. I have a 6-2, lot 35, Corrado K, 6-2, great cranking number. Not sure my lot numbers. Carl, you're supposed to keep track, bud. You're sitting over there just eating your scallops, not paying attention. Um, I I think I have you down, Carl, for – like I you're – you're the only Carl on my list, so Carl, you're lot seven. You're lot eleven. Slop Gumpy. You're lot eighteen. Slop Gumpy. You're not. You're lot thirty-five. I'm gonna do that one twenty-five. Slump lot one twenty-five for twenty-four. Lot thirty-five. I'm sorry. Lot thirty-five. Slump. I got gotcha. you. And lot sixty-nine. 35, lot 35 is slump. Good job. I think we got pretty much everything sold. I still have those. Uh, JP, just bear with me one second while I pull these out. <laughs> Guys, let's just finish this with a bang. I have these big ass power team lures, Texas rig jigs. It's 20, 30 pounds of plastic in here. Would anyone like to offer me? We had it, we had it at 100 bucks. I'll take 90 because it's gonna cost 30 to ship this probably. I'll do 90 bucks for all these Texas rig jigs. A huge ass bag of black and blue. Like this is a huge deal. If you guys are into this, green pumpkin, some watermelon red, green pumpkin. This is lot number six, originally lot number six, 90 bucks for all those Texas rig jigs. Anybody? <laughs> oh man, these people are funny. Nobody wants that Camus boat seat? JP, you okay, bud? Mm-hmm. All right. Oh, shit. Lot number 47, that Akuma. I'll do 60 bucks on that, guys. Lot number 47 is the Akuma 3000 spinning reel. Sixty dollars. Anybody? JP. Oh my God! Nobody's gonna buy that thing, dude. Why? Forty-five dollars. Zero eight eight one prime. Can you type in zero eight eight one JP? Oh uh, yep. Thank you. J Flocka, can you do fifty on that reel? Okay, Carl. Carl, sixty bucks. You're in, Carl. Sixty bucks. How's he gonna know what he bought if he doesn't know the lot numbers? How's he keeping track of them? Carl, it's yours. <sighs> All right. Anything else, JP? No, man. Thanks, everybody. You know, that was a slow start for sure. You know, I can't believe that Pete Jablowski just sat through four hours of an auction and <laughs> did it once. You are the epitome of a low life. Oh, um, shit. Carl <laughs> doesn't want the real. Carl does not want the real. 
<laughs> he sits there and I, I'm convinced now he's a hundred percent a troll. I don't even think the man fishes. <laughs> humorous at this point Hold on, i'm all screwed up jp hold on carl doesn't want the real but he wants the power team lures thank you travis stearman and how much does he want for him 60 bucks you're not going to use all those carl don't be greedy <laughs> carl do you want it let me know in the comments right now if you want those power team lures for 60 dollars. i'm only doing this because i like you Carl. Carl, Carl bought most Carl pretty much bought the whole house tonight. Yeah, Carl's Carl's a super fan. He's an awesome gentleman. Dude, this guy rocks. He's a big dude and he rocks a gelled hair. And he hung out all weekend long two years ago. I'm looking forward to seeing Carl in a couple Heck weeks. Yeah. Carl, you got the power team lures. I still need to get rid of this damn reel. This is brand new in the box, bros. This is a hundred dollar reel. Lot 47. Anytime you want, Steerman. <laughs> Carl's drunk. He's going to wake up and say, what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, Sean, you got some boga grips. Come on, somebody buy this so I don't have to just deal with this. Come on, JP, sell this reel. Look it hey, up online. It's a hundred dollar spinning reel, brand new. It's this has never been used. Uh, it's a hard buy. Carl, just offer him sixty bucks for the reel. Come on, Carl. You might as well. You already got this huge box coming to your house. What's one more reel? <laughs> Not many people didn't smoke me, Jablowski. I didn't practice. I caught two fish. John, you want that reel for 50? Mo money. Somebody tell me what's going on here. Lot number 32 was Mojo Bass 710 Medium Light Extra Fast. I don't know what's going on right now. We got to get this real sold so we can move on here. <laughs> All right, Travis, I'm done. You will wait until the real is sold. Okay, oh, John. Thank you. Bucks. The guy John, lot right. number 47. One. For 50 bucks, John. Lot 47, 50 bucks. John, you got it. $20 to smash the reel with a hammer. That's almost more enjoyable than sending it to somebody. Yeah. Carl, okay, I guys, we want to thank you guys so much for uh, participating once again in the annual smallmouth crush auction it's been a blast uh there might not have been as uh as much highly sought out items as there have been in the years past but as you know travis relocated up to the western part of new york and he's trying to phase the largemouth stuff out of his bloodstream and we're just really grateful that you guys support the channel you support travis you support eric and you support me motivationally except for jablowski and uh <laughs> i gotta let you guys know that through all this I have been as sick as I've ever been. Even to talk at this um, volume has been agonizing for me. And I'm probably going to the emergency room uh, when I get off. So, okay. Travis, I will see you in a couple of weeks. And everybody else, I'm going to bed. Peace. All right. See you, JP. <laughs> well, I always say we're never going to have, like, this is the last auction. But... For some reason, we seem to always have one every six months to a year. But I really, really feel like I thinned some things out. I hope you guys uh, 
got some good deals. I know you did tonight, and you'll appreciate that stuff. In the next uh, next day or two, I'll be packing all this stuff out up and shipping it out to you. Uh, Brand, you got to be a little higher on that prop, bud. I hear you. You guys did a good job tonight. I appreciate everybody. Uh, we'll be back with a regular live next week, Monday. And other than that, I uh, appreciate you guys hanging out. I'm going to head to bed. And as always, we'll see you guys on the water. Make sure you put your lot numbers and your addresses, please. If you forgot, send me an email at my just my junk email thing. It's T speed s p e e d that's my middle name t speed m at yahoo.com it, it's gonna help it's gonna help because i'm i there's always one or two or three or four there's a handful of items that i'm just really confused about and so the smoother that transition um goes the easier i'll be able to get all this stuff out to you guys so he don't want the spirit chats. Who doesn't want the spirit chats? Let me look through these comments. I don't know what anyone's talking about anymore. I'll always I'll follow up next week on our live if there's any payments I'm missing or any anything that's unclaimed. And uh and we'll go from there. All right, we'll see you guys. I'm out. Mo money, you're screwed. You Mo money, you got all those spirit chats, didn't you? Are you worried about that? Let me look. Yeah, you won 64 packs of green pumpkin purple gajo spirit chats. I'm out. You got to deal with it, bud, not me. They're your spirit chats now. <laughs>